Please be good, Ollie.
We're almost ready here. For what looks like I am bread torture. I'm pretty excited for this. I'm a little I'm a little scared. I'm a little scared of this game. I know it's gonna be dumb. But we we have had terribly painful times with like physics based games. So my body is ready enough. I'm worried though. See, that's what I need to get done. I need to figure out what I want for some animated ones because I love the animated ones. I think they're great. Like, it's nice that they're offering that to the small time content creators instead of just, well, you have hundreds of millions of followers. You can have nice stuff. I need to get those. At some point right now, that's not on the, the high list of priorities, but we'll get there when we get there. And it was so cold today, right? Alibaba. <laughs> I still like that name. I really do. Um, see, I, that's what I think, like, either have him, like, sliding into the, the right, with, like, a sword out string, like he's cutting something. Or have him, like, pose and then run off or something like that, right? And I feel bad, too. Because everybody loves Mocha. Everybody's aware of the guinea pigs. But I think Ollie brings the most intrigue. Because he's the only thing that I kind of scold while I'm streaming. I'm like, hey, I, ooh, I know karate. Like, I found, a, I found a group this morning online called Bunnies or Assholes. I'm like, yeah, we should join that. We have one of those things. And it is one of those things. We're probably going to find a lot of other people who are like, dude, rabbits are dicks. I'm like, I agree. I strongly agree. And they're going to show me little pics of them being, right? Mocha could be sleeping. Mm. That would be pretty adorable too, right? But man, I woke up. I turned my heater on this morning because the house was only like 65. I know that's not frigid. But today our high is only supposed to be like 45, which is pretty cool for around our area. This time... What, two or three years ago, the first year Rachel and I moved out, God, four years ago now, her first Christmas out here, it was 90. And she was like, oh, if this is how Christmas is all the time, I could deal with this. I said, no, 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 no. This, we're getting a weird heat wave. This is not the normal temperature. And now she's like, well, it's still warmer than where we would have been. I said, yeah, I know, but it's, fuck, it's cold, right? What's up, pop time, my dude? What's going on? What's good? How you doing this fine afternoon? Yeah, afternoon is right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But turn the, the heater on, right? Doesn't blow hot air. I'm like, are you fucking with me? <laughs> now I'm glad having a drink. Hell yeah. I've been too lazy and tomorrow, right? Because right now I'm stuck at home without a car, which sucks. So, like, I've been kind of trapped in the house. I'm not going to tell the wife, like, hey, I know you work all day, right? And I know you're making the house run. Can you go grab me some beer? So, like, I've been beerless. So, I've been drinking coffees in my me hoi minoi SpongeBob glass. We've been having teas and stuff. We haven't really been, like, partaking like we normally would. Being stuck in the house, by the way, not, like, not that I have anywhere to go. But the idea of just being trapped in your house is fucking horrible. Like, this reminds me of when I first got injured. Four years ago. And after a couple days, I'm like, I'm sick of being in this house. I'll break the leg to leave the house if I have to. Hurts. What kind of drink you having, though? 22 and then down to the teens. Yeah, well, like right now, right, we're kind of getting what I always call like our two weeks of winter. Between like December and like early February, we'll have two weeks where it's just like 40. Maybe 50 at the highest. And we're just, we're getting it kind of early this season. So I'm assuming... Our two weeks of rain in January is going to be non-existent this year, which I'm also okay with. And what's up, Maverick? How you doing? What's going on? What's cracking? The fuck was I talking about? So that's where we are today. I don't remember. I know I woke up. I played some Super Mario Brothers Switch U, Slappy Happy Fun Time Deluxe for the Switch for a little bit. Um, and then my game crashed at the save point, so I got to restart again, which is fine. Uh, I'm having coffee. Oh, that's right. So we're stuck in the house. Being stuck in the house blows. 
But tomorrow Rachel's off. So I'm going to get to leave the house, which is exciting. Very excited to leave the house. Buzz balls. All right, all right. So, but I turned the heater on, and it only blows air. And I was like, well, I don't really give a shit. Because when we first got out here, and we got the naked guinea pig, I was like, hey, let's get a, a floor heater, a little space heater for the guinea pig, right? Because I don't know. Like, I knew nothing about naked pigs at the time. And I'm like, well, I don't want her to freeze to death and die. She ain't got no fur, right? So we got a floor, little space heater thing. So when my heater didn't click on this morning, I was like, hey, we have something to fix this. So I had it sitting in the front where the door's open, you know? And Mocha goes, oh, I love that thing. And immediately laid in front of it. I'm like, Mocha, dude, it's blowing out like 100 degree weather. And he's like, I know. I love having roasted kitty nipples. And I'm just like, dude, the fuck is wrong with you? And he's like, oh, dude, I'm going to lay on it too. I don't even give a shit if it burns me. Oh, it feels so good. <gasps> like, he was in heaven. I was like, dude, leave some for the fucking little ones. He's like, nah, fuck the little ones. I'm cold. You've been in the bed with me under the blankets on a pillow all fucking morning. Don't tell me you're cold. You don't know, Dad. You don't fucking know. It's like, shut up, dude. Get out of here with that shit. Leave some for the guinea pigs. And like the guinea pig twins that are right here because they're closest to the door, they ran to the corner of their pen and they're like, what is that? Followed by, oh, that feels fucking good. So I'm like, well, better place a work order. And then after I got them placed in the work order, get a call from my insurance company. Get a call from another insurance company. Get a call from another insurance company. Get a call from a doctor. Like, Jesus Christ, everybody. Why are we all doing this at once? Like, are you just like, okay, so you call him between 9.05 and 9.18. We'll get him between 9.20 and 9.24. And then you can have him from like 9.27 to like 10. Like, Jesus Christ. I mean, at least I guess they're courteous about it. And everyone's been super nice. Um, none of them have been like stinky about it which is great it sounds like everything's gonna go through really quickly i need tampa bay arizona to lose and detroit to win <laughs> uh i mean who who are the bucks playing this week because see i'm back on my train where like i'm rooting against my team every week because i feel like they're due for losses even though our team is starting to come back which is nice i still feel like our team is like they're still a little down and out. I wouldn't say they're as beat up as they were, but they're still banged up, right? So what do we got here? Boop. Tampa losing to the Saints. Okay, so I bet a 20 to win five is fine. I don't think we're going to lose to the Saints. Uh, I don't think Hill is a great starting quarterback. I, I hate to say it, but as much as I disliked Winston because Winston, of his personality, I feel like that team was just a better team with him around. He can do more than Hill can. I think people don't respect Hill enough. But I also feel like he kind of deserves it, right? Yeah, but history doesn't always repeat itself. Because, I mean, if we're going to look at statistics like that, the Packers are going to lose in the NFC Championship game again. And I feel like this year, if they don't win, like... They've wasted a great team. Like, their defense is finally what everyone has been jacking off about for the last four years. They finally are a competent, legit, top defense. Really. Not just in some games. Really. Their offense has always been fire. There's not much to talk about there, right? Now, I believe in real history shit. Like, the Browns are always going to be trash. The Lions will probably always be trash. Some teams are just destined to be losers for life. But for stuff like that, I don't know. I'm not a big fan. I will say, I do believe the Bucks are in line for a loss, though. Because they've had a lot of games where, like, in my opinion, they honestly didn't deserve the win. And, like, the way the Bills played, we let them back in that game. We should have lost that game. Our team got tired. For some reason, it's whatever. And then you had Arizona. Who are they playing? Arizona. To lose... To the Lions? That would be fucking hilarious. I don't think it's going to happen. 
But I mean, that would be a hell of a game, right? I was, I'm not going to lie, after the Lions got their win, what, two weeks ago now? I was like, here's where they turn that corner and they come back. This is where they're going to get their shit together and they're going to rattle off like two or three wins in a row, right? And then the Lions last week, and I'm like, you motherfuckers. Like, this was the time for you guys to button that shit up. I got to give them credit, though. They probably have the most satisfying, like, sports record you could have at 111-1. Just ones across the board looks clean. Not very good. But, I mean, it's clean. Um, who's, is there any, like... I'm curious to see now what, what, what the Jaguars do without Urban Meyer now. It was time to go, though. He was... He's not going to be an NFL coach, right? Like, there's just... Some things in life are destined. He was not one of them, right? I'm surprised the Falcons have rattled off and become, like... They win now? <sighs> I don't know if I buy that right. Like, I kind of said at the start of the season... I was like, I have that feeling... That, like, Trevor Lawrence is probably going to be a bust. Fields is probably going to be a bust. I didn't have Mac Jones on my radar whatsoever. I have some hope for the kids, the kid with uh, Frisco. But I've already kind of, like, I was like, okay. So no matter what happens this season, right, Aaron Rodgers leaves Green Bay. (laughs) If he decides to keep playing. I'm like, what if he went to Frisco, right? He's kind of returning home. They have an okay defense if they can stay healthy. They have a run game. And they try to pull Devontae there with them. It's a super long shot. But, like, I think he goes no matter what. Like, I, I think he feels like his time there is just done. He kind of got some of the say and stuff that he wanted, but I feel like it's Rodgers. He's done with it. He's sick of it. I think the fans are sick of him. I think he's kind of, at this point, it's, it's not as bad as like Barb holding the hostage every year where it's just like, I'm done. Just kidding. I'm done. Just kidding. First game of the season. I'm not done. Ah, just kidding. Right? But I just feel like at this point, he knows he's not wanted there. I mean, like he's wanted, right? But, and he can say, oh, I don't give a shit. I don't fucking care. He cares. Because he, he, deep down, he has that mentality of, well, I'm going to be better than Favre. I'm going to be more popular than Bart Starr, right? And I, as someone who spent time in Green Bay and has been a long time a Packer hater, much as I love Favre, I think Starr will always be like the most favorite of the favorited Packers quarterbacks. Um... You know, Favre, dick pics, McGee, sort of tarnished that shit and then decides to go to the Vikings. Like, plus I know he's been saying stuff that people don't agree with. His, his, his tenure of love is gone. I don't think anyone ever really loved Rodgers. He's a great player. But I think personality-wise, like, no one's ever actually cared for him. I think he goes. I really do, right? He will end up in the NFC by tra- AFC. See, I think what he's going to do is he's just going to hold the team and be like, you're letting me go, and I'm going to go where the fuck I want, right? Do I agree that he should be in the running for the MVP again? I do. I still think Henry got snuffed last season. My big thing is, is the MVP is voted on by humans, and I'm curious to know how many journalists still hold that grudge of like, he fucking lied about being vaccinated. How long do they hang on to that? And how long do they go, no, fuck him? We're never giving him an MVP award again. He's a liar. We see how hated people get by the writers in baseball in snubbing first ballot people, right? He's under contract. He will be traded for request. See, I think what they would do, right? If, if Green Bay was smart about it, they would go, we're going to let you go. Right? But we're, we're, like, we're going to trade you. We're not just going to let you go. Because you, you don't just let... Great talent go, right? And something I'm sick of hearing from everybody with half a brain. Well, you know, he's getting kind of old. 
You never fucking hear anyone go, well, Tom Brady's old as he's still throwing TDs and still leading his team to wins. But for some reason with Rodgers being like five years younger, six years younger, well, you know, he's old now. No, no, no. Age at this point doesn't fucking exist. The idea of fitness has elevated to a level that nobody could comprehend. Aaron Rodgers can play five more fucking years if he wants to, and I guarantee you it'll still be a high caliber. Maybe he won't be the number one quarterback. It's still okay being a number three, right? You don't have to be the number one in the league to be the best. You just have to exist and be great. He's going to continue to do that. So I'm tired of people. Oh, he's old. Now, he has had some injuries. That's fair. But as long as you have a good all line, it shouldn't matter. He's not getting hit. Game after. He's not getting splat. Right? He's not doing that. But if I was the Packers, I'd go, where do you think you want to go? Value. Value. Right? Where do you think you want to go if we're going to get rid of you? And we're going to let you, you know, we're going to try to work out so we can, we're going to be nice on the way out. We're not going to be weird about it, right? Because honestly, right? In terms of the thrower of the football, Rodgers is number one till the end of time. We will never see another quarterback quite like him, ever. In terms of actual passing skill, and the ability to throw the ball away, dude is brilliant. And that's kind of why he's a dick, is because he knows he's brilliant. So he's got that, like, I'm a smart dickness to him, right? Which nobody likes. Nobody likes that. And what's up, Sukage? I had the Rams at the start of the season. That was my pick as soon as Stafford went there. Right? Stafford is Staffording, though. And he's kind of crumbling a little bit. The team don't look as good as they did. I had the Chiefs going to the Super Bowl. Never wavered on them. I know I know my Rams. Not my Rams, but the Rams be the Cardinals. Eh. I still don't think they're the best team. He could be a smug goof, but not a smug dick. Yeah, well, he's, he's always had this persona about him, right? And I think this year, like for the people who are on the fence, either they got fully behind it or they were just like, fuck this dude, we're done with this, right? And that's kind of why I think he's going to leave Green Bay, right? I think he's just tired of all the bullshit there. Go to a new team, do whatever the fuck you want. Because at this point, everyone knows how you are. So no one can be like, <gasps> God, he acts that way? No, you knew. He's been like this his whole time, right? Now, I will say, starting out early in his career, I feel like he had a grudge. When he slipped that far in the draft, that was wild. Nobody had him slipping that far. Yes, his release was bad at the time, and they fixed it. But, like, damn, dude, he slid, right? I get that, right? And you go to an organization that has had statistically great quarterbacks, like Aaron Brooks, like Billy Vole, and many other not-so-great backups that have gone on to make way more money than they should because they had a couple good games where they were able to push a great offense just good enough to get paid. Oh, yeah, and then they also had, like, Barstar and Brett Favre and Smug Rogers, right? Matt Flynn. Exactly, right, dude? Don't get me wrong, right? You know your team does something right when you can continually convince other teams, right, that this dude is that dude. I mean, I'm not hating. Dude's got to get paid. I'm not, I'm not mad, right? You're already in the NFL. So you're already in the upper echelon of players, right? Why would you do that? Like, you're in that top, like, 0.1% of actually fine-tuned athletic football athletes. Get your money. I'm not mad, right? Bro, we've been together for days. True. It's, it's hard to believe, man. Like, this year was kind of a waste because I haven't been around. But it's so wild to really think about it and be like, holy fuck, dude. Like, I've, Jesus Christ, it's been so long. I'm so old. Don't worry. One time when you roll through, we'll have a beer somewhere. I'll meet you and be like, let's have a beer, homie. It's got to be like this, right?
It's also not Matt Flynn's fault because Russell Wilson is a Hall of Fame. I mean, that's not his fault, right? I mean, no. But was Matt Flynn ever going to be really great? Probably not, right? In March? Okay. Actually, I think I'm pretty free in March, so that might be, that might be a, a time that might work. I know, what, I think April I'm supposed to be in, in Wizco for like a week. And then I believe in May I'll be gone, I think, for a couple of weeks. But I think March is super open right now. Oh, hell yeah. Hell. You know, I'm, I'm assuming by then the truck will be fixed and we'll be Gucci. <laughs> Cause if not, I'm be real sad. Play this goon accidentally hmm? subscribing to me fluffy stuff. Why would you do? Look that? at it though, right? Fourteen months. Like, that's fucking wild to me. It doesn't seem like it's been that long, but again, I did miss like seven months this year, so that's a thing too. Ooh, so biddy. Who doesn't like bit? You know what I love too, right? And maybe maybe I'm just a moron, but every time I see the little bits thing. Right? Doesn't it kind of look like a fucking caltrop from like the old medieval days? Ah, drop the spikes on the ground. Like, why? You couldn't have something more rounded that's more friendly. Instead, it's got to be like a fucking ninja star. Take my bitch. Ah. Right? I just, especially like with the silver ones. It's like, dude, if I step on those, they're going to hurt. You expect me to do a cha-cha dance? Not today, I'm sore. But if I was not sore, it would be different, of course. I mean, I'd be, I'd be down for a ninja star. I wouldn't cry about a ninja star at all, you know what I mean? I wouldn't. Come on, mouse, wake up, please. Thank you. Man, I love my wireless mouse so much. I, I fucking forget to turn that shit off. I think it's been on for like a week now. And it's still at green power, which is pretty good. The battery life on it is outrageous, right? Alibaba is also down. No shit, dude. I should, normally I, I do not condone Rachel dressing up the animals because she does take it way too far. But like, honey, could you make them a little samurai soup? I'd, I'd be down to clown for that shit. I probably wouldn't yell at that one. Ali Ninja, yes, right? Either that or like a little samurai suit, like get him some shoulder pans, right? She likes to do that stuff. I'm the one who's always like, please don't dress the fucking animals. Did someone just drop some bits on us? Oh, oh shit. shit. Yeah. Look at the... Whoa, that was weird. Why does the hair keep going away? Is that how that's supposed to be? Because that's creepy as fuck when the dude goes bald for a minute. What the fuck is going on? And you know, anytime a mod wants to shout someone out, like, feel fucking free to. I don't care. All right. Tis the season to spread joy and gape and stuff or something like that, you feel? Right? You know what sounds really good, though? It doesn't sound like I'm going to get gaped by my insurance. So that's a good thing. Right? That's pretty positive. There was a mix-up, though, that I had to talk about. Just going to slide the gape in it. Well, yeah. Literally slide in. Yeah. What about it? There's nothing wrong with that. But it seems like everyone's being super nice and cool about it, which is weird because normally insurance companies just try to fuck you. I've already been boned by my insurance once. So like Did someone just drop some bits on us? Stop it. Oh shit, they did. Hell yeah. I don't deserve biddies, okay? Why do the heads keep going away? The hair. What is going on? I don't know if that's a Twitch thing or a my thing. I like it though. And what's up, Captain? My dude, how you doing? What conversation did you walk into? Well, I'm definitely not a liquid dude. That'd be pretty hard to stream. Just have a fucking puddle sitting here. Blah, 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 blah. And what did you walk into? We were talking about some hand egg. Um, and then there was some resubs and some biddies. And then things got gaped. So you can, no pun intended, take that um, how you want. That's up to you. It don't bother me any, right? But I will say, Pop-Tart, if... If my Bucks lose this weekend, they had it coming. They've won too many games. I, I'm sorry that they shouldn't have. They should have lost to the Cowboys to start the season. right? I still believe, even with the headaches right now that the Bills are having, I still think the Bills are a better team. They should have won that game. So if they lose, I ain't even going to be mad about it. I'm going to respect it. I'll respect it.
I won't be a little mad. Not at all. They got a ring last season. I can't complain. Like, right? No complaints. But I really think I'm jumping off my Rams train. And I've been saying the last couple of weeks, like what the Packers have, offensive defense, like they look like a total team right now. Like a complete package team. They need to do it this year. Even if I'm not a huge Packer fan, they just like, they look like the best team. And I think if you want to go off ratings, <laughs> which don't matter to everybody, yeah, I coughed in your ear, deal with it. The Packers Chiefs, like you can't tell me that wouldn't have huge views. I really don't think the world wants to see Tom Brady in the Super Bowl again, and I respect that. I have no problem with that. There's not too many teams in the AFC, ratings-wise, I think would make for a killer thing. Like, if the Chargers got there, there would be zero Chargers fans in attendance. There would be zero Chargers fans watching because they're the Chargers. So that wouldn't be very good. And views are what matter. Because that's where that stanky cheddar comes from. And how's your day going, Captain? What's going on was good? So someone told me that you're all about NFTs now. And you're going to go all in on NFTs, dude. Bring back the Manning's bloodline in this. What's man? What was this? Want to buy Bitcoin? I don't want to buy any coin. Like, you know how long it took me? To be, like, okay with downloading games on, on, like, Steam and shit. Like, I still only buy physical games for my Switch. Like, that's the only console I have left where, I, like, I can buy something. Even though Rachel bought Madden in the golf game and Assassin's Creed Valhalla and Guardians of the Galaxy, which I played, like, three or four more hours of yesterday. That game gets a god fucking damn it out of ten. I've changed my review on that game. It pisses me off. Because the gameplay is fucking great. Graphically, it is fucking great. And then you sit through 20 minutes of talking. And it grinds my gears. It's like the perfect game. Ruined by story and backbuilding and stuff. Uh, uh, like, for real, right? Like, it's probably going to be one of my games of the year. Guardians of the Galaxy. It's probably one of my games of the year. It's not going to make it. Just because, how does that ever happen? Story is best. Because you play it, you get into it, right? And like, I know Rachel's like, I can't deal with this shit. It keeps taking control away from me. And like, it never really gets away from that, right? But she's like, I'm playing a game to play something. If I wanted to interact with a movie, I would just be on Facebook while watching Netflix, right? The gameplay is great. And because I'm a big collector whore, like, I want to find all the outfits. I got to collect all the little in-game currency shit to make your character better and stuff like that, right? I'm in chapter 7 or 8 now. Like, I, I put a big chunk into it yesterday, because for those of you who weren't here, Eldritch wanted me to go two more hours. For some reason, this chair fucks my back and my neck up right now. Surprise, I wonder why. And I just couldn't go anymore. So I made food. I laid on the sofa for a while. The cat was like, oh, I'm going to lay on your face. Once he got bored with that, I'm like, no, nah, this still doesn't feel good. So I put the head up on my bed. And I was sitting in the bed, and I'm like, well, I could sit here and beat my meat. Or I could play more Guardians of the Galaxy. And it's, it like, it's so fucking good. It just gets interrupted too much by story and stuff, you know? Your counters need to get the... Okay, so the, the things are, right, is that with the sub thing, like, it doesn't count. And I think the problem is... And I'm not encouraging anybody to do this. For some reason, and I don't know if it's a Streamlabs thing or my counter thing, I don't think it counts resubs because those aren't subs, even though they are, right? Like, they are, but I guess they're probably not. My bits thing seems to be working, but my bar coloring is all fucked up, and I'm not sure why that's being like that. Um, 
But I, I think resubs don't count as subs, though they're subs, which is bullshit, right? Because like, hey, I'm supporting your channel. Well, that doesn't count that way. Wait, what do you mean? Well, you see, that doesn't count that way. No, I have mine set to just subs. And what's up, Eldritch, my dude? What's going on? What's good? Subscribing to me. Ah, wait. Why would you do that? See, that moved. And it rolled over. God damn it, Seth. Stop that. They've gifted 90 subs in this channel. So it is... Look at this goon accidentally subscribing to me. Like I said, it doesn't recount subs, and I don't know why. Let me see here. Uh, what am I looking for again? Dude, my brain today is fucking gone, man. Like, I woke up, right? I lost my phone. You know where my phone was? You ready for this? Why would you do that? In my hand. I lost something in my hand. I, I almost turned my coffee pot on without putting the craft in it. Look at this goon accidentally subscribed uh, to stuff. Why would you LOL. That? Nope. Another hour in a different stream. Not gonna kill this man's neck. See, at least some people got my bag. Captain's just trying to break it. Look at this goon accidentally Getting ready to take a piss. I'm a fail because I couldn't find that? money for fake piss. Yeah, no, I have everything set to, like, just count subs in general. But for some reason, like, it doesn't recount Twitch Prime subs or Prime Gaming or whatever. Which, don't get me wrong, I think that's horseshit. Because anytime anyone supports your channel, like, they fucking... You, they should be more respectable about it, you know what I mean? And what's up, Seth, my dude? How you doing? What's going on? What's good? Okay, so background color, bar color is correct. What if I made this white? What happens here? Okay, is that me, or is that, like, whiter than my other one? What is going on here? Oh, my God, world, help me out, please. F9, F9, F9. Okay, hold on. Hey, you didn't even take my code, damn it. You didn't save. I'm going to be smet. Hell yeah, dude. Like I said, this is the first time in a long time where my beer has been, or my house, my beer, my house has been like devoid of beer. It's really weird because like, you know me better than that. But right now, I don't have a vehicle. I'm still waiting for the uh, insurance to get back to me and be like, yeah, you're good. And me be like, thank you. I mean, at least they've already said, like, you're covered for so much in insurance. And, like, uh, you, uh, I love that. Don't drive no more. Dude, I have to drive. I have to drive, right? It's been days. I've been out of beer in the house since, I think, Saturday. Right, so we're going on a full week of zero beer. Now I have, I have gin in the house. I could have gin and tonics. I'm not really feeling the gin and tonic though. Right, the coffee's been hitting me pretty good, and Rachel's new Viking beer that's like Thor's gaping hammer or some shit has been pretty good. But it's not beer, right? Like I'm, I'm falling well short this week on the streams, miss. Right, at least today we're feeling a little better. The neck is still kind of crappy, but like we're we're. I don't know if we're getting better or just dealing with the pain better, which I'm fine with because y'all know the story when I was in the hospital and I told them, either you get these IVs out of me or I'm fucking pulling them out. Like, I'm tired of feeling like a zombie. I'll deal with the pain. Just like, stop. No, because she, she do last night. She didn't get home till like eight. She's supposed to be off work at like five. So she was kind of crabby. I'm going to DM me on Twitter. I love Twitter, baby. DM me, baby. I swear to God, if it's a dick pic, dude. This, this would make my streams miss really good. Rachel called me a nerd. Wait, why? Is she in the stream? Oh, it's because I joined that bunnies or assholes Facebook group. 
I knew dude, it's always it's always dick pics, dog. It's always and I'm not mad about it. Like, you know, I would rather people send their dick pics to me than people who don't want them because I don't really give a shit. Like some people, right? You're just creepy enough. You're like, I, I, I gotta send my dick to somebody. I don't know why, but like. how low are your monitors no my monitors are like eye level this one's a little lower but i have everything set up a little bit i am thinking of getting the monitor arms because after i got the boom mic and i was like you mean to tell me that i can do this for my computer monitors yes i might sell out and get it There's something called, I am not, tr public, tr public transportation here is miserable, dude. Like, if you take the bus to the next town over, that's like a fucking 45 minute to an hour. I can drive that in like five minutes, going 90 on the eye to keep up with traffic. I'm not doing public, fuck that, dude. That's going to take with them. Gaping, full circle, baby. No pun intended. <laughs> public transport is good. I mean, don't get me wrong. I know out here they funnel a lot of money into that stuff, and I'm totally cool with people like, you know, it's cheaper than fucking having a car. Bar none, right? Like, it's so much cheaper. But I like the freedom of just like, maybe not right now, but of just being like, I'm going to go here to just get out of the house. I can't even do that right now. Growing, going across country, no. I would send you a dick pic, but I'm not a home wrecker. <laughs> uh, you know, the best thing is to, right? Like, if someone would be like, hey, Rachel, if he started getting dick pics, how would you feel? You know what she'd say? I'm surprised he doesn't get them at all. That would probably be her answer. Or she'd be like, can I at least see him too? And I'd be like, I don't give a fuck. You may look at this digital penis all you want. Speaking of digital penis, dude, so someone sent me a troll picture today of uh, the YouTube dude named Nick Avocado. They sent me a picture of his dick. That was kind of scarring, dude. Like, you could smell the dick cheese through the pic. I was like, oh, my God. Why do people find this stuff? And who really is like, I know somebody who would want this. Why? Why? What the hell is wrong with people? Well, duh, a bus full of passengers isn't very fast. Why you think footballers go to matches in a bus instead of 22 cars? I mean, <laughs> sure. But I don't even know what the going rate out here for the bus would even be. I would assume it's, it's fair pricing for what it is, but like, what, what dictates and deems fair pricing? When gas out here right now is like five bucks, which is disgusting. That's for the cheap shit. That's outrageous. Right? <laughs> Social media is just a forest of unwanted dicks. Why not get a personal dick? Right? Well, I know I saw... Uh, on my Facebook. A female friend was getting like... Super hardcore macked on. On Snapchat by people she didn't want. And it's just like, I could never, ever imagine in my mind, like, Hey, baby, I know you'll never meet me IRL, but I think you're a snack. Here's my penis. Like, how does your brain connect those fucking wires? At all. I know you're just posting a regular pic of yourself. But like, yo, look at this dig. What? What the fuck? <laughs> the match won't start without the footballers, though. If we take the bus and are 42.7 seconds late, you get fired. That's a good point. The audacity doesn't connect, I guess. But at least here, it's common to blame being like, oh, so when I was at first reading that, I was waiting to be like, 
Yeah, but here at least it's common to blame it on the audacity. I was going to be like, what? What kind of shit are you into, Captain? I don't know. Maybe I'm just old school. It's whatever. But I, like I said, I personally just don't fucking get it. Like, in any way, shape, or form, right? The audacity of not taking the bus. Dude, when you pay for insurance and stuff out here, you better fucking use your vehicle. If by old school, you mean being a decent human. No, I mean old school in the fact that, like, I'm not really a big technological dude. Like, I don't like Facebook. I don't like Twitter. I don't understand the points of them. I will say, a year and a half ago, I was like, Discord's dumb. Why do I have one? Flash forward to now, we're having sexy talk about NFTs. And stuff like that, right? Oh, personal dick delivery. Like, you know, I just, I don't understand social media in any way, shape, or form. It's not, I'm not saying it's a bad thing. But it's definitely just a not for me thing. Especially as I get older, like, I care about it less and less. Hey, my controller's not turning on. Come on. Come on. There we go. I care about it, like, less... In less, in less. Ooh, hey, the game is running terrible with my controller in. Hold on. Wow, that's not even getting like five frames. Holy shit. Okay, hold on. Look at that. That's not gonna fly here. Oh, and Mary Streamsmith, dude. Streamsmith is important, right? Though, right now, I'm at this weird like. Okay, why are you running so clunky? Like an in between with it? Because. Like, I've enjoyed playing a whole bunch of different stuff. I really have. And I hope that you have also enjoyed your time with a whole bunch of random stuff here on the channel. But, like, there's been a lot of people shit-saucing other people's picks. There we go. And it's just like, you know, if you don't like the game, you don't have to be like, well, this game is fucking shit. Just either don't hang out in the stream, right? Or sit in the fucking stream and shut the hell up and enjoy me. Like, them are your options. You don't have to be stupid about it. Because I, I like it. Like, I'm enjoying myself playing different stuff. And hopefully, like I said, everyone else is too, right? But for some people, it's just like, why do you have to be like this? Why can't you just like sit there like a good kid and just go, okay, I've had, you know, this is fine. This is fun, right? But to be stupid about it, like there's no point, right? So people should, I enjoy, I, I'm not, I'm not fucking barnacle man. I'm I'm definitely mermaid. Wait, no. No, because Barnacle Boy was the taller one. I guess I am Barnacle Boy. Fuck. So I am Barnacle Man. Hell yeah. What's up, Twink, my dude? How you doing? What's going on? What's good? Happy stream, Smith. Homie. We got your Christmas card, by the way. Rachel was kind of confused. She opened it up and she's like, What? Dude, what is this? We got a Christmas card. It's not from like our immediate families. That is whack. I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. Because she was so confused. This is going to be like the best worst game we've ever played. I guarantee it. Just because it's about being a fucking piece of bread. Like there's no pun in this shit. It's you're literally bread. Like I'm kind of moist for it. I can't lie. Um, but after all the streams miss is done. We're going to look into uh, maybe having some of the games back. Like I'm not going to say I am bread will not be back. Because I'm not going to say that it can't. But, like, this isn't really, like... This is a fucking meme, right? Like, we're, we got trolled with this one. 
which is fine. But, like, I would like to finish Batman. I'm not saying XCOM can never come back to the stream, right? Like, we're going to kind of gauge. Because, um, like, like I've always said when I stream, like, I don't look at numbers and stuff. If people come through, that's great. If no one comes through, that's great, too. I don't give a shit, right? So, maybe for this stuff, we would look back and be like, okay, what games gauged the best that way? But, again, I don't like looking at numbers because I don't really give a shit. If they're good, they're good. When they're not, they're not. You feel? Please say you're capping. You have one. Yes. Ah. You wanted to send out cards, and I wasn't getting matching pajamas. Dude, why not? That's part of being a boss ass bitch is getting matching pajamas, bro. Rachel and I wear matching pajamas every night. Pretty much curious what we sleep in. We sleep naked. So, but we're not getting pictures of that either. You feel? Are all we're okay? Let's play the tutorial first, right? Like Mama Birth, it's just cheaper, right? And besides, like if someone breaks into your house, I would love to get into a fight with someone butt ass naked. Like they're like, give me all your jewelry, and I'm like, this is my dick, and they're gonna be like, ah, and they're gonna leave the house because they're gonna be like, like they're gonna have to go to therapy. Like, Dude, I tried to break into someone's house. <laughs> Seriously, he just started helicopter dick at me. I don't care that I had a gun. He whipped his dick out at me and ran at me. I want a restraining order against that guy. You already know I'll be down for more XCOM. See, if I'm gonna, I think if we're gonna do like XCOM, XCOM stuff, right? Just run at him making the thighs laugh me. No, like, damn right I would. I think I'd want to play Gears Tactics just because. I like Gears of War. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. You guys sleep naked. Well, yeah, dude. It's though it's been really cool as of late for us. So like, I'm naked, but she'll sleep in like a little tank top and like some underwear or something just to try to stay have have some articles of clothing, right? Stitched jammas. Interesting. Or butt see butt flap jammas are worse. Fucking ad, dude. I'm naked now. That's how it should be. Like I said, after my stream, the first three things that come off, bandana, whatever headgear I'm wearing, that includes my glasses, and normally, at least my shorts. Like, I answer the door naked. UPS guy's there, I'm like, give me my package, no pun intended. Like, just hand that shit over, you don't need that, it's mine anyway, right? Just, wanted opportunity. The safest self-defense is for dudes taking your pants I almost choked on an orange slice, laughing at the thighs. <laughs> In my mind, you were, I mean, like, I technically can't run because of the rod in my leg, right? But I can still move quickly at you with my dick out, so like, be ready. Moving bread takes practice. You can grab the corners of your bread and then click and drag your mouse, or use the control stick to flop the bread around the corners try to copy the movement wait hold on i don't know how to move yeah hold on like okay oh oh shit okay hold on This game is gonna be a fucking nightmare. Oh god. Okay, hold on. Wee. Come on. Climbing is a vital skill to any for any bread to learn. Consider your grip meter. Okay, so we have a grip meter up top there. I like how we can just kinda like shimmy shank. You love this game. I've never fucking played this game before, so I have no clue what I'm getting into. Like this, I have, I have been, I've had days where I've moved like this. Definitely not sober, right? But like, oh my God, <laughs> you're literally bred. Okay, 30 objects, oh, and the floor will make bread less edible. If your edibility reaches zero, you have to start, are you shitting on me? 
So the whole point of this game is to roll around in dirt and still be eaten? That seems fucking st Oh, shit. Oh. Hey, we're getting eaten alive. Okay, hold on. Come on, get up, little buddy. As you expect. Okay. Wait. So we have to toast ourselves? Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What the fuck are we doing? I am toast. Congratulations. No, I didn't even do anything. Hold on. You wait. Play it again. Wait, what the fuck was that, dude? I did two things. You can't tell me that's the whole game, right? You moving like a... No shit, dude. It ain't my first rodeo of running at someone erect. Hold on now. I feel like there's a there's a story here that we, we're not getting the whole thing of. No pun intended. Oh my... Okay. This... Okay, so this is gonna fuck with me because, like, it makes sense, right? That, like, your, your pieces? Your, your bread? Like... The buttons flop around as you go, so it's not always just... Bumpers, triggers, bumpers, triggers. This is gonna be dumb. Hey, you good, Ollie? Okay, hold on. Hiya, okay. If one of your corners touches an object, okay, grab it. Wait, hold on. Grab it. No. Come on, slide over, you drunk piece of shit. Uh, uh, okay. So you can. Oh my god. Why would anybody make this game? Like, who who, who was like, you know what we need, guys? Come on. Uh, we need to make a game about being bred. And someone was like, you know what? I sign off on this shit. I'm all in, dude. This sounds like a multi-billion dollar uh, idea. Wait, hold on. Go this way, please. Uh, This one? This one? This one. Wow, you can move really wild. The bread is now Spider-Man. No Spider-Man spoilers. Use this space to practice some very difficult climbing. This is not an easy climb. No, you wait. Hold on, game. I'll figure this shit out. Oops. I went to school once. Hold on. Yeah. 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 Uh, wait, hold on. What if... Oh, God. Oh, sh nice. Okay, we're, we're figuring stuff out. Hold on. Come on, little buddy. Move your bread ass. Come on. Oh, because our let. Oh, shit. Okay, wait, hold on. Stop. Game, I'm you up. Okay, hold on. Okay, so right now our bread's just like fucking the steps. It's just like, uh, uh. Uh, okay, so slide you back a little bit. Get your ass up. Get up. Get on up. Come on. How? Okay, this is actually a little harder than I thought it was going to be. I'm not mad. No! You piece of shit. You're clearly some stanky ass bread. Because you're not wanting to work like you're supposed to. Wait. Oh, come on. <laughs> you wanna. You, you. Oh! Oh! Wait. Come on. Get your bread ass up there. Yes! Okay. Um. Okay, so do this. And then do like this. And then like this. Oh, yes. Oh! Dude, we're a fucking bread climbing champion. The game said this shit was hard. Get the fuck out of here. Um, okay. So if we go this way. Yes. Oh my god. Oh, wait. Oh, oh. Okay. Grab. Yes. Okay, sw wait, sw swing in this way? Yes. Yeah. Oh no, I'm dumb. Oh. This is this is why you don't drink in bread. I'm just saying. This is this is showing right here why you do not drink in bread. This is fucking hilarious, dude. I thought this was going to be a bad time. I lied. This is going to be a fucking great day. Uh, I just need... Okay, so... you Really finagling your character is kind of smelly, right? Like, it's not... It's not the end of the world. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, come on. Bring it back. You ain't no holler back, girl. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh! Here we go. Yes! Okay, now hold on. Which way are we trying to... Okay. Um... Hiya! Oh, you dumbass.
Okay, hold on. Let's do it. We can get this. Dude, we went to school once. Okay, hold on. Left. Okay. This is, this is fucking, <laughs> this is like the dumbest shit I've ever seen. And I'm absolutely in love already. Okay, hold on. Okay. Okay, now whip around. Oh, you drunk other mucker. This has, this is a better game than Dark Souls 2 confirmed. The story's probably going to be great. Because this game has a story mode. Ghost bread mocks us. <laughs> okay, so that's good enough. Let's let's just go char our ass again and then start the story mode. Cause this game has a story mode. I'm sorry, game. I'm trying to cook evenly, okay? I'm learning, I'm learning. I am toast. I love how it even dings for you, little thing. Okay, begin the story. Here we go. This game has story. Burn the nose. Walk away. The laughing has almost killed me twice. I can't eat or drink. Okay, hold on. The therapist barn. Mr. Merton. Okay. Spent most of their session talking about his past, mainly focusing on his failed business, Merton's Morts, and the subsequent divorce from his wife, Barbara. He moved on to... Uh, Threatening the council again, as well as the local carpet world. The session ended with him angrily stating he was going shopping with the intention to eat himself to death. I like where this is going. A. He appears to be dealing with multiple stress points and focusing all his anger towards the council, for which he still claims they are responsible for the downfall of his business. I believe him now being employed by the council as a street cleaner is exacerbating the issue. I suggest he attempts this Oh, at this, at the time, things are not going away. But a positive outlook is imperative. We have another session booked for tomorrow. The shopping trip should take his mind off the events. Okay. So before we actually get into this now, I need to go get more coffee. I need to bleed some coffee out quick. And then we're going to figure out what the hell's going on here. I hope we're actually in a story where we're bred, right? Are you finding your smoke stash in the corner? I hope so. I already like where this is going. Big old donk in the cam there. You get toasted and life is good. I mean, something like that, right? I am curious to know what that date, though. Is it March 4th or April 3rd? Because I know everybody writes their dates down differently. Hey, wait. Okay. Become toast. 
Okay, so we're... Okay. Not everybody. Just Americans. That's why I... No, no. Possibly April 3rd to you? Okay. Wait, you're timed too? Hold on. Don't... Not like this game. Don't time me. Well, we gotta summon our inner Pop-Tart here. We gotta knock over all this alcohol first. Oh, touching the floor is bad? Sh shit balls. Keep going, little buddy. Keep going, little buddy. Keep going, little buddy. Come on. Keep going this way. You got this. You got this. Why is there fucking bugs everywhere, dude? Wait, where do we get toasted at? Oh, we have to get over to the toaster? Okay, hold on. Um... I, I loaf toast. <laughs> okay, so let's quickly try to get across the ants. You'll never get this. You'll never get this. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Jenga. Come on. Uh. Oh. Okay, so right trigger, right bumper. Like, that's, that's messing with my mind a little bit. Come on. You just pull that shit down. Come on. You drunk piece of toast. Fucking drop it. Or don't. I don't care. Oh, God. I feel bad for the ants. Yes! Alright. This game... <laughs> this is the best game of Stream Smith confirmed. Like, this is ridiculous. What? Like, I'm not even... You know it's gonna be good when I'm not even mad. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. <laughs> yeah, oh... Whoa. Peace. Okay, hold on. Just take your time and shimmy shake over. You don't judge me. I'm getting there, okay? I'm getting there. Oh. Water can't be good. You can drown. What? Dude, what's wrong with soggy bread? The fucking hot dog champions do that all the time. And doesn't the music sound like something else? Like, I'm hearing another song. I don't know which, which one. Okay, let's see here. Okay, so, new plan. So this is, this is like an open world game. Okay, we can, we can tackle the shit how we want to. Okay, slide me this way. No, stop, stop, stop. Whoop. You boop. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Stop. Okay, here we go. Come on. Get up. Get on up. Oh, yes. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Okay, here we go. I gotta go this one's. Yes. 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 Oh, look at that. We're a professional bread, baby. Ooh, this is good stuff. How was the wall not considered dirty, though? Okay, wait, hold on. No, don't. You son of a bitch. Not like this. Nah, don't do me like this. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, so let's take... Dude, we're gonna fucking crush this game. Like, we're gonna become professional uh, I Am Breaders. This is great. Okay, hold on. Shit. Wow, you... Okay. This game has some of the best fucking controls. I'm not even shitting you. Like, they're so tight and clean. Okay, fall down, go boom. Oh, you get grip back? Oh. No. Yes. No. Yes. Do that little captain shimmy shake. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, hold on. You're on a hoe. Oh, yes. 
Dude, we're so good at breading things. Don't you? Okay, hold on. No, not like this. There we go. Oh, okay, wait, hold on. Yeah, okay, hold on. We're good. Dude, we're so good. You can't even, you can't even stop us. Don't stop me now. I really hate how well this game controls. Like it's, it's fucking disturbing. Like this has some of really clean controls. Now fall in. Come on. Get toasty with me, buddy. Come on, please, please. Come on, fall in, go boom. Okay, hold on. Come on, get in, please. Get in. I know you can do it. Oh, God. My bread is so drunk right now. Right? This is what we're trying to do, right? Like, it's it's got to be what we're shooting for. <laughs> this is so fucking stupid. I love it. I'm in love... No, no, not like this. Okay, hold on. Just ignore my flappy bread here. It's like flappy birds, right? Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. Get in. No, wait, wait. Okay, hold on. We're not out of this yet. Because there's nowhere else. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, hold on. I think we can maybe... Because the, the stove's on, I see. Right? Maybe we can just, like... Go stove ourselves. Try wall jump. Wait, there's points in this game? There we go. There we go. Okay, now hold on. Okay. What the fuck? Oh! 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 Okay, hold on. We're stuck. I like that. I give style points. Not game. No, come on. No, no, no. Please. Right? Get up and over. I know. There we go. Okay. Now, here we go. Let's get real, though, right? This is the realest sounding plate you've heard in the game in a long time. Like, that's... No. He is. I don't know if this is how we're supposed to do it. I am the captain now, right? Pump your way to warmth. And then... Okay, hold on. Come on. Hiya, splash. Dude, we're already I am bread... Breadians? Or breaded champions. So much for that plate. Wait, oops. I'm sorry. Wait, what do you mean 80 or better? I thought, why wouldn't you want 100%? What do you mean run of the mill bread can't even run? Are you shitting on my face right now? This is basically the dark. <laughs> okay. So first off, we did it in under 10 minutes. That's good. 80% edible. Oh, that's our health. Never mind. Toast. So we only have to have 80. That's kind of weird. I suppose though, not everyone likes their, their uh, bread with a little char in it, right? Never run out of grip. Okay. So we're just going to go to the next day. I cannot believe the game grades you on your breadness. I feel like there's a metal song in there somewhere. Treatment notes. No, this is the same day, isn't it? 
No, it says different stuff this time. But it's... Oh, that's just our birth date. I am dumb. Hi, I make fluffy stuff. Dr. Merton has been very distressed throughout his session. He arrived earlier, exclaiming that his house had been broken into, but there was no signs of forced entry, and the assailant had only been in the kitchen. He had not reported it to the police, as he believes the council were tormenting him and the police would be in on it. It took three subtle hints that his 60 minutes were up before Mr. Merton ended the session. I advise Mr. Merton to clear his head of his kitchen, specifically moving things into the lounge. Hopefully, this will trigger his memory. This is a very worrying development. Clearly, he cannot recall the incident in the kitchen. I will review his diagnosis with colleagues and perhaps consider appropriate medication. In light of this, I have scheduled another session for tomorrow. Okay. So, the bread is alive. And we're tormenting someone who's gone theoretically a little crazy. Okay. So, looking around the room, right? I'm trying to figure out, like, what is butter surf me, baby? You can't beat it. Yeah, let's get out, right? Can we can we get out of this? I don't think we can. Hold on. Rock the boat. Don't rock the boat, baby. Rock the boat. Don't tip the butter over. Come on now. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Ah. No. No, 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 no. Oh, we're so dead. Rip. I'm not eating that, says the game. Brett is surely in the therapist's house and wants to end his, end his life from all the fucked up stories. Okay. This is probably a game in my free time I'm probably going to play through and try to get the achievements for. Because I feel like the achievements in this game are just like break shit. Do stupid stuff, right? And I'm not, where, are we, where do we get to cook though? Or do I have to like... Okay, so we're not going that way. Right, like, I don't think we're gonna be able to cook on a pan that's just chilling, right? Like, that doesn't make sense to me. Hold on. Okay, so go one, two. Nice. Okay, we didn't we didn't take too much damage there. It's it sounds weird to say damage in a game like this. Yeah, yeah. Ah, no, you were supposed to grab you shitty piece of bread. Okay. Wait, stop. You're hurting me, game. Okay, here we go. This game. <laughs> I did. I can't even handle this. This is the dumbest thing. And I'm absolutely in love with it. Okay, hold on. No way. They don't want us to cook on the lamp, do they? I'm bread man. Uh, um, yeah, here we go. Look at that. No PS2 in the house either. Don't underestimate my brain power when it comes to games of bread. No, 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 no. Okay, hold on. No, yes. I have become bread, eater of worlds. I don't even understand how this game has such good physics. Like, for a game I thought was going to be totally ass. Hey, wait, hold on. It looks like a real beer logo. Hold on. You Come on. You need to turn a little bit. That looks like one I've seen before. Had before? No, 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 no. This is fan fucking test. No, yes. No, the 
that's the end of the run, I bet. Oh, wait. We're still alive. Woo! I'll figure this out. You watch. I'm still thinking it's the lamp. No! Yes! It's... It's gotta be the lamp. Don't you... Okay, hold on. Let's waddle this way. Let's waddle this way, right? Do you really love lamp? I just... I'm looking at lamp and I'm going... It's gotta... We gotta... We gotta bang lamp, right? Oh, come on. No, please. Okay. Okay, we're getting there. We're learning. Don't fuck me, game. Oh, yes. Um. No! Not like this. Come on. Get, little buddy, get. No! This game is teaching me why books are bad. I'm gonna lose because of books. Because of books! What happens when the other buttons show up? So you can... When the buttons come up, you can grab onto that with that... I want to say arm, but it's not an arm, right? Like, that piece of bread? Whoa, what is this? Wait, what are you doing? Wait a minute. The game just gave us, like, a bonus. Whoa, we're, like, invincible with the jelly on us. What? Is, it, is this, the, like, the game mocking me? No. The the left bumper, right trigger in that, that is for moving your leg, kind of like with Quamp, right? And then the grabbing of the buttons are to actually, like, grab onto stuff. Uh, uh, ooh, ooh. Come on. No. Yes. No. Yes. There we go. Ah, ah. Okay. All right. I don't know how long the jelly lasts for. I'm going to assume it doesn't last forever, though, right? Like, it shouldn't anyway. Now, come on. Keep your bread ass moving. No! Yes! Oh! Egg in the gang. Yes. Oh, no! Wait, that doesn't matter, because right now we're invincible. Huh. Yeah, sick right there. If you hold X, you can just, like, extra hang on to stuff is all. But when you're holding on like that, right? Like, you can't, you're, you're basically stuck in place. Now, you can release it to let go, right? To, like, help try to fling you up, if we could figure out how to... If we weren't so bad. Ah! Ooh, ooh, okay. Please. <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? And why is it so good? <laughs> Loaf. Oh no! Don't knock the tapes over. We're not a savage. You're not a savage. Don't do that. Do not do that game. That makes the controls much more complicated. Yes. Well, yeah, no, right? Because, like, it kind of... Well, okay. So, right now, we have the, the jelly bonus, right? So, like... This is just me blowing smoke up my answer, answer. But I feel like that also... Uh, the, the face buttons... Probably reduce your grip meter, too. So, like... It's, like, right here, right? I can't grab onto anything. There's nothing for me to touch it with those buttons. So it does add a layer of of shit to this beautiful, um, beautifully wonderful game. Dude, I feel like I'm doing gymnastics. I'm just doing... Oh, no! Son of a bitch, you grabbed the glass. Eat my toasted ass game. No, am I stuck now? Not like this. Hey, hold on. Is okay. Okay. 
Okay, hold on. Now let's go this way with it. And let's drop her down. And go this way. And then go... No, wait. Wait. Wait, what? I, uh, oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Now, can I tip you? Can I can I drop you down? Like, can I can I tip you over or something? Because I feel like that's. Wait, hold on. Is this gonna be something stinky? Where like we're gonna have to take the lamp, and move the lamp, and then put the pan over the lamp to cook ourselves? Is this game gonna get like overly fucking complex for what it is? Here we go. So hold on with A. Let's try to get some momentum here. Okay, it doesn't look like I can pull this down. <laughs> okay, that's not gonna work. Um. Okay, is there a way for me to crawl maybe like up to the light? Let's see. If it does, you can always set the house on fire. I don't feel like that's what the game wants us to do. Uh, okay, so now let's try to figure out here how to... Oh my god. <laughs> the buttons are so whack, I love it. Okay, hold on. You wait. Just hold on. Oh shit, don't do this to me, janky camera. Okay. Yes! Okay. Ah. Oh? Come on. We need we need you to drop. Yes! No! Yes! Come on. Come on. Okay, hold on. Yeah, keep falling. Why not? Now, come on, you drunk piece of shit. I need you to tip over. Is there a way for me to... Can I climb up into you? I fucking knew it. Shit balls. Okay, wait, hold on. Come on. No, oh, come on. I know you want to tip, please. Tip over. Come on. I know you can do it. If anyone's drunk enough, it's you, Lamp. Okay? Come on. <laughs> please. Okay, wait, hold on. Roll back. Come on. Come on, Momentum. Come on, please. I just want to tip you. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay. Yes. Now, wait, hold on. Shit. Come on. Turn a little more. Come on. Okay, wait. Yes! Yes! Oh, come on, baby! Oh, look at that. <laughs> we're getting there, we're getting there. Okay. Now, we've got to get the other side on there as well. Um, so let's see if we're holding here and no, wait, no, not that side, not that side, no, 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 wait, no, sexy, look at the, oh, I suppose you can't see the bread timer because my camera, so this is what we had to do, I guess.
Hey, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Wait, hold on. No, 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 no. So, what the game right now is telling me is that you also have to move the bread, right? So that each... So, oh my god, okay, hold on. We're gonna have to move this for this game. Display, no. I need, what do I need? Webcam? Webby, you can go here. Webcam frame, you can go here. Webcam. Let's get you in your box again. Okay. So, as you can see on the screen there, the bread has to be buttered uh, just just so, I guess, on each, each piece or each side. And we've burnt the one side. So now we have to get it... We're going to have to maneuver on this box <laughs> ah, to try to get our, our bread fully cooked. This is dumb. And I love it. Now we have to think here like... How do we have to maneuver, right? To get us to where we need to be here? Without cooking the other side anymore. Because I feel like that's gonna make us lose, right? And I feel like if we just hit the ground, we probably won't cook. We will not. <sighs> okay. So we're like, I don't want to say we're right there. Right. But we, we, we figured out the secret sauce. Sort of. Loosely, right? We need to go like this here. Wait. <sighs> okay, so we need to go... I wonder if there's multiple ways... Right? To like... Toast yourself? Followed by if there is. Yes! No! Don't cook that side, cook the other side. Come on, game. Okay, we're just gonna keep wiggling around because it keeps going up here. Even though our one side is totally charred. The problem is here is I'm not sure which side at this point is which side. So I have no, no real fucking clue as to which side I'm trying to toast. No, we okay. You know, fine. Overburn. You know what? Nobody gives a shit at this point. Let's just try to get you. Okay. No. Man, I bet the people that are legit at this game are like fucking beast mode at this. This is how I imagine it feels to try to get your kid in the bath when they're younger, right? They're not like they're not just going to go in there, right? Cuz water bad. So like This is this is the fighting Can I grab the lamp? There we go. There we go. There we go. 
There we go. I think we got it. Don't stop ticking, please. Nice six. Nice seven. <sighs> no, you fucking stopped. 98. Oh, come on. Yes. Yes. I love that. Needs. <laughs> Improvement. The fact that this game has a fucking campaign for bread, I'm okay with. But talk about a crazy ass idea. Dr. Martin was distressed during this session. He claimed his lounge had now been broken into. He relayed his uh, suspicions and beliefs. He had discovered the culprit in leaving a message by placing a singular slice of toasted bread in the room. He claims the kitchen had a similar incident, but it never stood out to him at the time. He then appeared to be deep in thought for several minutes and left saying he was going to test a new theory. It just came to him. Oh, I would love to buy followers. How did you know? Mr. Merton's condition seems to be deteriorating rapidly. The stress and paranoia are leading to him destroying his own home and what appears to be blackouts, leaving him with no memory of the incidents. His fixation on blaming a slice of toast must be some sort of manifestation and his hate of the council as the blackouts seem to be occurring as soon as he gets home from work going to increase patients conditions to severe will now maintain daily sessions for his own safety dude become toast okay so i'm assuming our options here are going to be the light up top Oh wait, no, that's not going to work because we're going to run out of grip. Okay, let's fall down for now. Come on. Um, there we go. Wait. No, I need a right trigger. Oh, that's not going to help. Eh, it'll kind of help us. Okay. Once you figure out like the do's and don'ts, the hardest thing really is just keeping track of like what what corner button is where. I like how, oh, you know what? I bet that last one we didn't get a rating because we touched the jelly. We have to remember to not touch the jelly if we're gonna like have a for real playthrough. Because I think that's like, I guess to help you get through it. No. Okay, hold on. Oh, the wall is disease. Hey, hey, that's some, I mean, it makes sense, but like, that's some bullshit. Okay, hold on. Oh, so that part of the wall is gross, not the whole wall. Okay, hold on. So if we can make... <sighs> okay, let's think about this here. So a good chunk of that wall is gross. Okay, right bumper here. Let's try to... If we can get this... Let's see. Down on the ground. Right. No. Can I? Okay, hold on.
No! Oh my god. Why? Okay. So. Hey. Okay. Yeah. Come on, don't do this to me, game. Slide this way. Got it. Slide. Let's see here. This way. Slide. This way. No, oh, come on. Come on. Stay. No. Wait. Okay, hold on. Let's just hug this wall for a minute. We got to think about this. Are we terrorizing the therapist as a priest of red? I don't know. Like, I'm not going to lie. Out of all the games that we've played for Streamsmith so far, this one has the potential to be game of the year. Hey. Okay. In terms of story. Like. I'm almost overly intrigued with what's going on here. If only because we are technically just... No! Not like this. That was such a good... We're dead. Because we're not going to be... Fuck me. Oh. Oh. We were so close to doing good there. I was so happy. Ah. So either... We... Right, and this this is what I'm hoping for here. S story spoilers potentially, I don't know. Either one, our character is actually the toast, and we're acting out through the through the toast, which would be great. Um, we are potentially a demonic piece of toast, right? Because we don't know exactly what kind of studies. Or where the count, what the council's doing, right? Like for all we know, like the council's making possessed food or some shit, right? So there better be like a a, a really great plot twist somewhere in here. Let's keep going. Come on. No, no, no. Turn a little more. Thank you. No, not like this. Wait. What were we touching that was dirty? We're already dead. Oh, my God. Don't do it, Ollie, please. <sighs> okay. I... Bet this game, like for the speedrunners of this game, I bet this shit is hilarious to see what kind of lines they found where they're just like, oh yeah, you just go boom, 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 you tap this, you fall this over, you double front flip over this shit and you're good to go, right? Like. Oh, this is the dirtiest floor I've ever seen. The floor like eats us alive. Okay, so let's think about this here. What other plans of attack do we have? I'm not touching the jelly this time, we know better. I think we've learned our lesson. So, if we go this way, right? We could potentially go up the wall because that wall doesn't look dirty. Go to the nightstand, go to the shelving units, quickly try to swing over there to drop onto that table. Right? Like here, clearly, they want you to go because you have that clean little area there. We just have to be able to get to that table quick enough. Or the, the shelf, I mean. And the floor is like, not necessarily auto death. Yeah, we're dead now. Oh, okay. So true facts. The more corners you have touching the bad stuff, the quicker the timer ticks up. So if we were almost able to like walk there on, on, on two bread corners, 
it might not tick down so quickly. This is... F okay, so now... I still don't think the game is hard. It's just... Having your brain continually register like... It's this trigger, it's this bumper, it's this trigger, it's this bumper. Right? Because there's no definitive like... I mean, clearly you can see which part of the toast is the top, correct? But being able to decipher that on the fly when you're eating shit is not very easy. Okay, so we're stuck here. No, we're not. So we'll try this way one more time. Let's try to grab the, um, the plate again, right? To try to give us not necessarily a safe point, but... Come on, game. Why do you not want to give me this time? There we go. And then take this here, up and over. That was not a good throw. But maybe we can just slow drop down here. Nope. Okay. I don't know. I'm not I'm not trying to move you up that way. Here we go. Come on, go under. Oh, come on. Don't be dirty, shelf. Yes. Alright, so now we just slow slide here. All right, let's try not to get too wild with it while we're up here, because, like. What if we go like this? And kept moving this way. Okay, fall down. Oh! Okay. We're gonna get a strike. He's. Okay. See, that's my next plan. I'm just trying to see here now, like... Okay. So, here, here's what I'm thinking now. What's with all the crap on us? Let's go like this here. No! Oh! You have betrayed me, game. Because I was going to say, let's go right from the pitcher to the table. Now, hold on. Yes. <laughs> no. What? What did I die from? There was not. There's not even any thirty there. That was a great run game. Okay. Was the table covered? I didn't fully look. Uh oh. Uh oh, my bread seems to have clipped through. Uh, okay, hold on. Uh, oh yes, janky game is janky, I love it. Okay. So let's... Dude, no, go back! Okay, hold on. Hey, wait a minute. Yeah, I see that. So what happens is when you go over the garbage, is that hurts you? Okay. I wasn't expecting... Okay, well, first off, like a bloody band-aid is not that bad, right? Who's afraid of blood?
But I think what happens is when that stuff gets into you, it's like the Band-Aid keeps slapping you. And I think the Band-Aid is what's taking our, like, our hit points away, right? This is the stupidest... Come on. Yeah. Oh, yes. Make love to the bread. Ugh, dude, look at this fucked up three-way. Smashing the loaf and the slice? Oh, yes. Okay. So let's go this way. No, I didn't want that. No. That's cheating game. Shit balls. Okay, so this part of the wall is clean. Can I restart? Thank you. I don't want I don't want the jelly. I'm gonna jelly this dick in here. No, it's not it's not like that, okay? It's not like that. Don't dude, I will fucking eat you, you piece of shit. Okay, here we go. Yes, yes. All right, we're, we're making progress. We're making bacon. No. Well, we're making toast. Look, ma, no hands. There we go. Okay, so we need to flop around this way. Oh, oh yes. Oh, I'm fucking spider bread. Get in there, buddy. Yes. Wee. Oh. Whoa. Hey, don't break nothing, game. Hey, hold on. Get this out of here. Do you fucking see those skills right now? Get out of here. We're professionals. Okay, rotate me. How high do you have to be to be like, dude, we should make a game. Where we're just trying to, you know, we're just trying to get like, hosted. Yeah, I was trying to do it the cute way and like, okay, hold on. <sighs> These buttons are weird, man. No, don't touch it now. Don't you dare. No, no, no. Can I bring you down? Come on, get off the shelf. Because there's, I mean, we could probably burn ourselves on that, right? I mean, I suppose we also have a pretty clean shot right now, I think, to the, well. Yeah, because we could go from that night shelf that's in front of us, or the cabinet, to the table really easy, right? Right? Right. This isn't dirty, is it? Okay, hold on. Let's let's re-get our grip here. Ooh, we could go to the iron. That's a that's a that's a fact right there. This is fucking stupid. I love it. Uh oh. No. Wait. Don't mess with me, camera, please. You're scaring me. Not like this. Okay, drop down. <laughs> okay, so this game has fall damage. Not that I thought I'd have to worry about that, but whatever. Okay. Oh, okay. <sighs> All right. So we can either try to fling ourselves from here, which seems super dangerous. Right? We could try to go from the table over. I oddly feel like this is probably the safest way. <sighs> the board does look a little dirty, right? I'm not gonna lie. But it could just be because it's used too, right? 
please just you i know wait are, are we stuck i think we're st okay we're not stuck Yeah, roll me back a little bit. No. So... I don't know if we're going to be able to, like... I think we fucked up. Yeah, one of the pieces say I can grab, please. Come on. Because, like... Okay, here we go. Okay. That's pretty good. Oh, man, I'm like, I'm so afraid to do this because of how weird the game's physics are. Like, I don't trust myself. Um, is there, if I can get one, well, I guess the only way to know is if we go for it. And it's not even dirty. No! Game, don't you do some stupid shit right now. I'll be so fucking mad. I'll be heated. No pun intended. Come on. Come on. Okay, now we need to turn ourselves over. Not, no, not this side, right? I need, okay, hold on. That's the side I need, right? Yes. Wait. That's right. We at least need to toast it to... A hundred percent, though. Which means... No. It is this side. I don't care if both sides burn. You know why? Oh, come on. Just one more percentage. No, please. No. Come on, you flappy son of a bitch. Yes! Yes! How the hell are you supposed to crab walk that shit in four and a half minutes? Like, that took us that to get off the fucking counter. That's okay though. We technically beat it. I'll take a D for stupid. That's fine. That's why I said like, could you imagine someone speed running this game and they're just like double front flip off the bed onto the iron right away? That would be insane. Okay. Dr. Morton came in very panicked this morning. He told of his theory that the bread was somehow responsible for the incidents. He then described how he placed the loaf of bread in his bedroom and returned from work to find his bedroom had also been upturned with a singular slice of toast sitting among the mess. He left today, or he left saying today, would be the day he was sure his theory is correct. I proceeded to remind Mr. Morton that he would make some very absurd claims and asked him to calmly step back and consider what he is saying. I know from previous sessions that Mr. Merton's home is not in the best kept condition. I suspect he is experiencing moments of realization. Regardless, or regarding this loaf, I'm not entirely sure the meaning behind it. It is clearly not real, and I'm having trouble coming to a suitable situation for him. Regardless, I played along and advised him that he should throw this loaf out both physically and mentally. 
My hope is this will allow him to stop blaming his situation on bread so we can move forward with his treatment. Wow. How does this game, a physics-based bread game, have a story? No. What the fuck? Why are we in a bathroom? Okay. I have to know. Let's get clean. Okay. So we basically have like no wiggle room here. We have to like squeeze out. Okay, hold on. No, yes. Yes. Okay. Wait. Is that the only light? Oh shit. We need to go up. Oh fuck. Okay. Um <laughs> Okay, hold on. Knowing what we know now, right? Like this and this. Get up. Get up. Take this here. Try to flip us around a little bit, right? No, no, no. Okay. No, we're we're in it to win it, right? We're gonna be red champions. Come on, keep going, little buddy. Hold on. <laughs> this is fucking great. I love this game. Who knew that I needed a... a uh... Like, this whole week has been nothing but good stuff. Darkest Dungeons 2, while it was hard, it was good stuff. This is just... Just as much cockball torture as that game was? Wait, hold on. There's not even a clean spot. Like... Wait a minute. What? Um. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Don't. I mean, the cabinet's clean, but the only light I'm seeing is up there. That can't be right. Hold on. That wouldn't make any sense. Hear me out. Because you have a grip meter. That's where we gotta get to. The little mini heater. We were looking at this all wrong. Oh no! Oh! Yeah, we're dead. Wait, you're not dirty? Get in the trash can, you stupid bitch. You're done. This run is done. We've done ourselves in. How was that not an achievement? So I watched a speed run and they basically fly. Yeah, I would believe that. Like, I'm sure they understand the physics how to get get to where they need to go. Don't get me wrong, though, right? I bet it looks really funny when they know what they're doing. Okay, wait, hold on. Don't fall in. Don't fall in. <sighs> God damn it, Leroy. Get out of here. Okay, here we go. No! No. Is. I've never, like, this game needs so much concentration, and yet, like, it doesn't at the same time. They just flew by. Ignoring the ironing board. No, no, no. Yes. 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 Okay. 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 Uh oh. No, no, no.
you when, when your perfect run gets ruined. No, get wait. Get lay down. There you go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now what I want to do. Right? We wanted to get rid of that so we had more room up here. No, no, no. Wrong buttons. I need these ones and these ones. Okay. Now. Okay, that is clearly filthy. But we can we can walk across the, the door, right? This shit reminds me of, like, Goat Sim. And the fact that, like, it's just dumb enough to be cool. But it's not dumb enough to be dumb. No, no, yes. Shit. Wait. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay, hold on. We're getting there. Walk that bread ass over, baby. Okay, here we go. Okay, hang on. No, yes. Okay, hold on. No, don't you uh, game. I will fucking shit a brick if you dunk on me right now. Wait, are you not on? Don't tell me I gotta turn this on somehow. Like I'm smoking. Come on. Okay, wait, hold on. <sighs> no. See, I'm trying to like see if I can um like drop down, right? Because it's smoking like it should be toasting. No. Okay, hold on. Right. Like, I. This feels correct. Right. Like it's it shows that we're toasting. What our meter Wait, is there a special spot we have to sit? Hold on. So it slow toasts? You know what? Okay. So what if... What if there's multiple things to roast yourself on in the level, right? So like, if you're really good, maybe you use the blow dryer over there, right? Or you're really good and let's say you get up into that lamp, right? But because we suck, we took the shitty way out, and we're gonna slow cook our ass on the radiator, because that's all I know. I mean, our meter's going up. It's not going up really quickly, and I'm not 100% sure why. Like, I feel like, I mean, we're smoking. What if, can I get in between it? Probably not. You know what? Let's not die a hero. Did you use the rocket? That's how they did it in the video. So there's little like trick shots to do then. I didn't even know there was a rocket that you could launch. That's interesting. So a bread based physics game. That has the player. Using little uh little secrets and shit that's hilarious 
Like right now, our thinking on this game is so small, right? Because we're just trying to get to the end and trying to cook ourselves. Like this is a fucking nightmare though. Why is this taking so long? Like at the rate we're going here, right? We're not going to be able to finish the, uh, like get done in 10 minutes. Because we've been sitting here for almost two and we're no more really cooked than we were a little while ago. Holy balls. I mean, I assume this is correct, or at least a way to do it, right? Okay, hold on. What about you? Can I turn you on? No pun intended somehow? Yes! 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 You're just mad. You're just mad. Oh, you're just mad. Okay, hold on. No shit. Not like this. Nice, nice. This was an achievement, by the way, for tapping the blow dryer. Oh no, what? Eighty-two percent. Come on. There we go. And then we flip this over. Like this. Damn, we're getting so good. You wish you knew how to toast like we toast. Okay, hold on. Look at that shit. We're so smart. Don't stop, please. Yes! Yes! I don't even care if we get anything else done. Mm. Oh, you know what? Okay, notice how it says the toast quality? Like, I just thought about it, right? Like, that's not our health. The game legitimately wants you to get an even toasting. Each side is 50% because we basically just cook the two corners. The game's like, I'm not, I don't want to eat that shit. Joke's on the game. I don't give a fuck if you'd eat it. I'm not too worried about it. I'm trying to insult my grilling and stuff. I felt it was important, or no, I felt it was, well, yeah, I read that right. To document today's events despite no official session. Mr. Merton showed up at my house shouting he wasn't crazy and that it was bread all along. Clearly unhinged, I quietly told him to leave his car here and come with me to the office for another session. I rang ahead and arranged security to be ready. On the way to the office, he described how he'd locked the bread into the bathroom, and when he got home, a single slice still managed to make itself into toast. Apparently, that was all the evidence he needed. Could you imagine having these conversations with people and just being like, no, for real? Like, even no joke. We arrived at the office where I promptly had my men take Mr. Martin to a secure location. It was not safe to have him go home or be left by himself. He was immediately very distressed, but mainly because... He said the bin men were arriving tomorrow and the loaf was in a bin in his garage and had to be destroyed. He only calmed down when I promised to take the bins out for him when I dropped his car back at home. I've already called some specialists and I visit Mr. Merton tomorrow. I fear these sessions are the only normality he currently has left in his life. Get toasted in the garage, brah. No shit. I like how the game starts us off. Because... <laughs> fucking story-wise. Hiya! Oh! Okay. You wait, game. Yeah, okay, hold on. The jankness from the camera showing through a little bit. Perfect, perfect. So where exactly are we trying to go here? So there's a light over there we might be able to cook ourselves on. 
Uh, uh, there's a light up top there. Hey, this is the music from the uh, the trailer. This song's a fucking banger. Uh oh, uh oh. Hey, hold on. We're still in it to win it here. I mean, like we're we're moving forward, right? So that's good. I'm not sure if we're necessarily going because like that's probably the heater, right? The light probably makes the most amount of sense, but I feel like that's like too straightforward. No! No game! Come on! Oh, you janky piece of shit. You janky piece of shit, you. Okay, hold on, I'm not mad. Come on, keep going. Uh, well, we can keep swinging this way. And then, okay. I like having a spot to chill. This is fine. This is nice. I hope it turns out that this is like fucking alien bread or some shit. And like, there's going to be a deeper meaning to the bread. Fuck. All right. Let's think about this here. Okay, so we know we need to get up out of the trash can. Right? We know this to be true. So let's get up and out of the trash can. I swear, Lid, if you close on me, I will eat your ass. I'll be so mad. I'll be fucking heated. Okay, so what if we go... Let's see. Fall back down. Kind of re-get our footing here. Our breading. Okay. Perfect. Now. Let's see what happens here. If we go towards the ceiling. Right, is the wall is the wall considered uckies? The wall is not uckies. No, the wall's gotta be uckies. Hmm. Okay, hold on. I just want to know how the wall's not uckies. Like... Oh, come on! No, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Right, we're not out of it yet. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if they made a DLC for this that was a meme that was like... It added garlic bread or some shit. Okay, fall down. Stay up. You are not falling like this. Okay, let's get you around here. Okay. Okay, so I'm looking at this here and I'm gonna go... I don't think I'm gonna be smart enough... To get across to that, uh... That light. No, 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 no. He is. Shit. Come on, grab him. Go. Uh oh. No, no, no. It's got to be one of the swings. That's fine. There we go. Come on, keep going. Come on, keep going, please. There we go. We didn't hurt ourselves. Oh my god. <laughs> the gift that keeps on giving this Christmas. I am bread. Okay, let's stop, please. Please. Just swim me around. Come on. I know you have it in you, bread. 
I've seen you like wiggle around before. You're pretty good at moving and stuff. Don't don't not move right now. There we go. Come on. Oh, you son of a bitch. Okay. Well, go with this. Uh. Yeah. Okay, hold on. You fucking wait. We'll get this shit. And you're gonna be blown away when we do. You're gonna be mad that we do. You're gonna be like, fuck this. He's not supposed to beat this game. There's no way to beat this. It's impossible to beat this game, right? You're only beating yourself. Shit. Um. No, I touched the jelly. We started. We don't want the jelly. That's cheating. We're going to beat this as God intended. Why would you fucking put jelly inside the trash can right away, you goddamn goons? Unplayable game. Toastless out of 10. Wood butter again. Uh, okay, hold on. Can I worm our way? Don't close on me. No. Come on. Don't you dare. Oh, shit my pants. Here we go. Uh... Hey, hold on. Come on, don't do this game. No, no. You ever, you ever do something or like you feel like the harder you try, the worse it gets? That's how I'm feeling right now. Like we had such a great start getting out of this. No problem. Not a single issue in the world. But now I think we're thinking too much. And we're only hurting ourselves. Hold on. That is correct. Now, throw yourself up. You're a stupid piece of bread. No! Okay. Let's think about this here. This, this to me just doesn't feel like the way to go, right? Like, it kind of feels like a trap. Okay. I go this way. Nope. That is not what I wanted to do. How is the wheelbarrow not considered dirty? What the fuck? Well, I'm glad they cleaned this shit out before we started our excursion out of the fucking dumpster. Yes. No! Get your ass closed. Why are you open? You gotta stop this game. This is, this is fucking madness here. No! You son of a bitch. Not today, bread game. Not today. Okay. There is probably some really... That should be an achievement. Putting yourself on the chainsaw, damn it. Okay. Go up, over, going this way. Oh, the floor is, uh, the wall's dirty. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. Don't talk to me about it. I know. 
don't. Ah, I'll restart. Cannot believe. Okay, now, now this game. It's getting to us a little bit. It finally, it finally hit us. Like we're getting our dick smashed here. Unfairly, might I? No. Yes. No. Yes. Okay. Sit here for a second. Okay. So the wall there looks clean. We could probably lay on the light. I mean, I can't help but feel like that tank is what we need, right? But I feel like knowing what we know now with the, uh, did you use the rocket? Like, what if we could get on the fire extinguisher, right? And just like Johnny Neutron blast off or our Jimmy Neutron, right? Like, got a blast. You know what I mean? Now it's got me thinking a little bit, which is not good because... Then I'm going to start to do shit that I know I shouldn't try. Right? Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. No. No. Come on, make it. No, no. Shit balls. Okay, I guess we're going this way. No, 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 no. I'm dead on the inside right now. But let it be known that only 6% of players have the turning on the hairdryer. Only 8% of players who own this game have used more than one heat, so heat source to heat themselves in a single run. I'm pretty proud of myself. I have two super rare in-game achievements. That players can't comprehend how smart I am. Okay. Okay. So take... Yes. Here we go. This game is so fucked. And I love it. We have covered a lot of weird shit this week. Like, this has been an interesting stream week. And I feel like people this week were more positive about the games played than they were last week's. XCOM seemed to be a very decisive a game for a lot of That seems to be one of those please no more not again ones. <gasps> yes. Yes. No. Yes. No. Okay. Okay. So let's get let's get across here. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I can't help but think that's gonna be considered. Dirty, right? That's okay. Right? The important thing is we're still alive. That looks broken. So. That's fine. We're still at 80% edible. Right? We have... We have life to play with. Ah, no, Ollie, come on. <sighs> All right. 
we're actually doing pretty good right now. If everything goes the way it's supposed to, and that light is what I'm thinking what we need, or something that we could use. Granted, we're going to have to take breaks because... Nope. Touching the light did nothing for us. Okay. Let's try to climb up, I guess, and see what happens. Wait a minute. Oh, that's corny. So, the pegs, like, basically stop us from climbing this? Okay, shimmy shake over. Come on, not like this. No. 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 God, trying to get the buttons is the hardest thing with this game. Like. Oh, yes. Come on, just a little more, little buddy. Okay, there's got to be something good up here. There's no way the game lets you up here, right? With just nothing. I don't believe it. But let's... Okay, so... Now hold on. There is a way for us to climb over here. These puzzles are harder than Baba Yaga, or uh, not Baba Yaga, but Baba is you confirmed. Oh my god. But this one is more fighting with the physics than the actual game. <gasps> no, wait. No. No, don't get sloppy. Please. Hey, hold on. No. No. Okay. Um, okay, so we're, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. no, okay, hold on, you know what the weird thing is with this game, and like it just hit me right now, so the developer, developers, whoever made this game, Right? No joke. Had to make multiple paths for your fucking piece of bread to go. To give you replayability as well. Which is outrageous to me. Okay, I think we're stuck now. Which would be terrible. Okay, hold on. Right there. Wait, no, come on. Grab it, please. Please? Please. I will figure this out, game. Oh, perfect. There we go. As long as we don't fall, I'm okay. But if I fall... I'm gonna fucking be heated right now. Come on, fall down. Okay. So I'm thinking this is where I wanna be. Okay, we turned it on. Successfully failed my piss test. Oh. Hey, we didn't run out of grip on that one. What?
that kind of sucks. I mean, you had said though, like, I knew it was gonna happen, right? Still lame. So when we're done playing this today, later on, I'm gonna have to look up and see exactly where we can go, like how many other areas you can go, right? Gotta find some money by tomorrow to buy some fake piss and Rick take it. Do start the 24 hour stream, 17 hour stream, 10 hour stream, and be like, donate to the uh, clean PP fund. I haven't had a donation in like a year other than some subs and some bits. Yeah, so I have to see what level were we on? Oh, wait. There's only like two more days up. So we've almost almost beat this game. Only been able to cash out like once. Hey, it's still better than not trying, right? I gotta see something here. We're gonna shut this off for a second. I wanna see. This twink was saying that the speedruns get crazy for this. You, hub, let come. I am red garage speedrun. I am red. Any percent speedrun, four minutes. Okay, hold on. I was watching a dude from New Day on G4 yesterday playing Mango Man. Yes. Um, Xavier Woods is one of the actual, like, host hosts for that, which I think is great. Okay. So let's just see with, with this fine YouTube content creator here. Has created for a speed run. Oh, whoever thought starting at the bottom of the beam was a good idea was very, very wrong. Right, let's use this ironing board as a springboard and go left here. I'll try. Wait a minute, do we even see the ironing board? But did you see that? Did you see that? Did you look at this? What is this nonsense? Right, let's use this ironing board as a springboard and go left here. I'll try. Look. We couldn't imagine of doing that. We couldn't dream of doing that in a million years. Like that is insane. I've right, so many times, and it hasn't really worked out for me. So let's try and get onto this white shelf. Oh, okay. Oh, just about made it. Swung underneath, then swung back up. Let's try and get across this as quick as possible. All oh, the glasses <gasps> pulling me down. Okay, we're good. Let's climb back up. What oh, the yes. fuck? Both legs. That's it. Very nice landing. Oh, this is going so smoothly. Right, we'll try and get jam on myself. Don't think I've got it on myself, but let's keep Wait, going. Wait, you want the jam on yourself? Why do you want jam? I've got to avoid that green sludge on the wall and get over this ceiling mount thing as quick as possible. Let's get across the box. What the fuck, the dude? Okay, oh, we picked up a sweep. That was a very nice fling from the pot. Okay. Pack. So we're doing it wrong. The, the sweet has and it looks like they're only trying to swing using one arm. We've turned the heater on. And this is going very nice. I think we're going to get a very good time here. It's got to be A++ as well. Right, let's flip over. We've done 100, 106% actually. Edibility hasn't been affected though. I don't know what we've been toasted on. And it's an A++. Also that was fucking crazy. You can have a thumbs up there, my doodle. Damn. Like, 
damn damn so we we have a lot of, a long way to go here with that stuff because clearly uh that person was just like yeah 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 done i am not i am bread Best enjoy with, yeah, I know that. You know, I didn't even see an option in the game to like legit use keyboard and mouse. Sorry, Mo. Wait, what do you mean I'm only 26% complete? Fuck you, that shows there's only like. Wait. Do each of these? Oh. I love how we got an E here, even though it's not a real thing. To the garden. Ah, to the garden. For anyone who think I forgot, I didn't forget, right? The Wizco trip will probably happen in April. Sans anything with my body, but I don't feel like it's going to be that bad. They're probably just going to look at me and go, well, you're still alive. Slap me on the ass, and that's going to be how that goes. I visited Dr. Morton today. Despite his drowsiness from the medication we administered yesterday, we went ahead with the session. He was very adamant that I detail exactly what I saw when I dropped him off from his car. And if I had seen any slices of toast in the garage. I didn't recall seeing toast. Though once I mentioned that some of his appliances turned on, he became very alarmed. I tried to calm him down by mentioning that I did place his bins outside. And while I did, I did take a look at the loaf, it seemed like just an ordinary bread loaf. He relaxed for a few seconds until I specified that I had left the loaf on top of the bins. This sent Mr. Merton into a panic as he lashed out and attempted to escape from the room. So clearly he must be in a padded room now. Um, unfortunately, I had to end the session early by calling in security to restrain him. Clearly the medication isn't working. Mr. Merton still believes his bread is somehow taking on a life of its own. To become toast. When I say it out loud, it becomes clear how far his mental state has fallen. I think it's best if I hold off the session tomorrow while I investigate some alternative treatments, as the current methods are evidently not working. Become toast! Okay. This is, I was about to say, does this level have no music? But it does. It's just very, very peaceful. And I know the uh, the 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 me the new day people. Like Vince is trying to tell them that like, oh yeah, the money you make from your your Twitch channel is like half of ours. Because you know, you're only famous because of me. Now I don't know if they fought that or if Vince had a change of heart. But it was just like. I don't think you can do that. Oh, okay. Okay, hold on. We're not, we're not looking too bad right now. We are safely walking along this fence. We are finally getting places here. Shit. Oh. That's true. It's only a matter of time. I just want to know. We'll try going this way then. What he does with the company. Before he passes on. Like, is he going to give it to Steph in trips like everyone thought he was? Is he going to just sell it off for the purpose of selling it off? I don't know if this is the way we want to go, but I have no regrets. <gasps> I had no regrets about it until right then. I am really curious too, like, how much damage to their brand, to that brand, is done already 
like the writing has not been good at all like i've watched little abridged versions of raw i haven't actually watched raw in about like two months i think i watched rachel and i watched one this monday just to see what was going on and we were just like yes yeah, you're fine um not that AEW has good writing. I think right now neither brand has good writing. But it seems like AEW is more for smart marks than like wrestling fans. Which is why I think they don't they don't have any of the stories really going on. Because they don't need to worry about it. They're like We don't need story because No! No! I don't think he's going to step down. I really believe Vince is going to hang on until the end of time. Like, he's he's going to make sure, like... I have this feeling he's going to be one of those people that's like, The boat goes with me, damn it. This brand, I made it. It's going to sink with me. Hey, hold on. Okay, I like where this is going. So if we're careful about this here, we can hang on to this and position ourselves to like be able to stick on the wall and hide, which is awesome. Yeah, I, uh... Come on, get up. Okay, hold on. Stay there. That's fine. This doesn't hurt us. And this gives us another opportunity to, to climb the magic mountain, if we will. Rotate more. Rotate more. Ah! And this is not dirty. Big, juicy nut. I like this. Okay, hold on. What happens if we push you over? Come on, fall. Fall, please. Fuck. No. Okay, hold on. Okay. Hmm. Very odd. You know, I was I was enjoying a lot of AEW too. But right now it feels really I'd almost say formulaic. Like every week you're gonna have a, a CM Punk come out and talk for a good five, ten minutes which is whatever. You're going to have a woman's match that completely gets ignored, which is sad because they have such great women talent and they just do not give them any time. Like, I'm tired of seeing the women's match always be... We're going to a commercial break now. Like, you really can't have a dude's match be the one that goes to commercial. You always got to do the women's, right? Like, I'm glad to see that the women are getting a new belt. Or I guess not a new belt, another belt for AEW. I just, like right now, a lot of their women are hurt. So I don't know if they have enough to actually warrant two belts. It's kind of weird. Um, all right, we'll go the other way. Can we get cute here with the fly? BRB. Cowfish shit. Okay. This map. This shit is some savage shit right here. This is rough. This is actually hard. This game would make for some fucked up ASMR.
Let's get resituated again and try to get comfortably plopped on the wall here. Ooh. And for all my PC gamers out there, today started the 15 days of the Epic Games free games give thing away. So each day they're giving away a new game. Today is Shenmue 3, which I know a lot of people, at least like most of my friends didn't have a Dreamcast to play the original two. I heard 3 was kind of lacking. I also understand they didn't have the development money in the department like they wanted to, but it's still a free game. And they're also doing the deal that they always do at Christmas time where if you buy a game you get a ten dollar off voucher for your next game you purchase and they continually give you the ten dollars off every time you buy another game it's over 15 bucks or 14 bucks i want to say it sounds so gross dude it seriously sounds like someone fucking pounding pud. It's just bread. Okay. Wow. No! Fuck! Okay, hold on. Let's let loose here. Whew. Let's try to get back up. Right? But I know for tomorrow's game on the Epic Game Store, normally they give you like a little teaser. Uh, the wrapping today had a little picture of cake on it. So I'm thinking it's going to, because I swear one of the ukulele games was like ukulele's birthday bash or something. Now I know that's a game they already gave away, but for the people who didn't get it the first time. Look out for a potential free game tomorrow to grab. Oh shit. Come on. Yes. Okay, can I grab onto this and fling this or no? We can, potentially. Mm, okay, so not really well. I hope this game has a fucking crazy plot twist at the end where it's just like, you were the bread this whole time. It was just a bread sim game to see if you, you could live life as a piece of toast in the wild or something, you know? What if I go up from here, actually? Because I feel like we need to get into the fucking car or something, right? Like, there's a reason why the car is so far away from the start. And we probably need to use a piece of the glass to, I bet, break into the vehicle as well. Yeah, so we're, we're good here. No game. I'm gonna say, what the fuck you mean that's us gripping? We're not even doing shit. So we need to find... I don't even know if we're gonna really be able to, like... Move this shit. I mean, you can clearly see that it's got a, a window, so like... We'll figure this out. There's, There's gotta be something to this, though. Like... Oh, come on, you bitch. No! Okay, now hold on. Hold on. Shit. And like, I'm a f oh! Okay. So. We're at least to the car. No! Is. Okay, hold on. 
Oh, because there's bird shit on the car. That's funny. I think we missed our moment, though, to get into the vehicle. Though, looking in there, it doesn't look like there's anything that actually would let us, like... Oh! Okay. There was matches. And a grill. So we have to probably... Oh, my God. We gotta get over there. Probably light the match. Put it on the stove. You know, this looks like a game that I know a lot of people who would play the hell out of this, and they'd actually be really fucking good at it, I bet, too. Like, watching me play this is awful because I fucking suck. Yeah, let's slow down. Boo shit. Okay, let's keep walking. Perfect. Well, it's oh, it's perfect. Oh yes! Look at this perfect fucking climb up. Oh come on. Nice. Okay. I'm just trying to think. Like I don't. I'm not really seeing any other place to cook our shit, like, and I highly doubt it's going to be. Like nothing, you know, the lights we found out before, not all lights equal, equal heat. And let the record show. That our, our movement and the way we walk, like this, is very basic. Seeing that they were just throwing themselves on their speed runs and shit, like clearly we have a long way to go before we are bread mass. Oh no! Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Shit, shit, shitty shit. Okay, hold on. I was bread. Where would I go? This looks like I can burn myself, right? This is where I'm going to get the, t the host yet. Look at that. We got someone dropping a follow over here. And today. right now, I'm not seeing anything, but I will figure this shit out. You watch. You watch, game. Hello, silly cat 69 What's going on? What's good? Good name, by the way. How you doing today? It's fine morning, afternoon, or evening. Ah. Okay, hold on. No! No! For shame. Get in the water, bread. But this game has everything. Amazing physics. A story. Which was unexpected. It's got it all. Get on the wall. How can I be the only one playing it right now? And I also was unaware right now. Uh, we're doing what's called our Streamsmith. So we let people kind of nominate games they wanted to see. And then we just randomly pick some. This was one that was picked. I had never heard of it either. You're literally bread trying to do bread stuff. This is fantastic. Though watching me play it is embarrassing because I, we, were, we watched one speedrunner video. Put me to shame. Made me feel bad about myself. Like watching them just... Spider-Man across the map is a piece of bread is beyond me how they figured out how to do that <clears throat> But this is this is fantastic ah, Okay. You just got to know uh, Like this is the first game that made me really think about like Bread physics, you know like I'm gonna have trouble sleeping tonight Imagining that my bread has bread physics that I was never aware of Thank you for liking the name. Sometimes it's a lie, sometimes it's not. You actually caught me at a period right now, it's not really a lie. The beard's in full effect, thankfully. You know, he's right to feel bad about himself. 
Uh, there we go. Let's get this going here. But this 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 is fantastic. I don't remember it costing too much too. I think I got it on sale for like two or three bucks. I won't say it's the greatest two or three bucks I've ever sent, but it's it's probably like for an actual loaf of bread. I think I would rather have this than the actual loaf of bread. No, no, yes. Hey, hold on. Yes. Woo. Okay. Hey, hold on. Good stuff. Now, I think we need to get over to the... To the barbecue. I'm pretty sure that's what we're shooting for right now. I still want to know why this equals grip here, but in most of the other maps, it was just whatever. Okay, so we're going to have to do this with, like, lightning speed. Uh, well... One, it's, it's one hour, and two, I think there's only one level left. Like, I think we're at the end. But I don't even know. <laughs> okay. This... That was not the way I wanted to go, don't judge me. Here we go. That was, oh, okay, we need to get, uh, okay, so we need to get ourselves up and over as quickly as possible. So here we go. Good stuff. Let's keep going, little bread. Now let's try to get you up a little bit. There we go. Look at these skills that pay the bills right here. Look at me go. Okay. Um. No. Yes. There was gift subs, but Seth had said today, he's like, not today. I know you're beat up, so we're not going to make you play all day. We know that the man's neck is wrecked. We'll just let him be for a while. So I'm assuming what he'll do is when I'm playing Kenna in like a week or so, he'll be like, now we can have the extra hour. <gasps> no, 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 my life is over. Ah. I love that. Just flop and suffer. No. So every day we have a sub goal, a bits goal. Oh, hey, my battery died. That's why the game dumped out on us. Um, and then a, a donation goal. And then every goal we hit over the course of the stream, it just adds an hour. So some days, yes, people do want to punish me. Um, some days, like last week, uh, we hit the subs, the donation, and the bits goal. And we ended up playing Lego Batman for seven hours. So, like, wanted to watch us play Lego Batman for seven hours? <laughs> I have no... Oh, okay, what's the goal of the game? So the goal of the game is uh, it actually has a story. We're not 100% sure what it is yet. But for what we've seen for right now is um, we are a piece of bread that is basically tormenting like a scientist or a doctor. Um, the character in game is getting actual treatment or like psychosis essentially because of the bread basically tormenting them. Um, and we're just tormenting them, I guess in there you know it's really weird too because out of all the games that are kind of like this that we've played like no joke this game has the tightest controls out of all like the weird physics based wonky games the fact that they've tried for a story is pretty incredible and the con the like the controls themselves are actually really responsive and if what we saw was right, like each each map has multiple ways to beat it. It's just a matter of do you understand them all? Like we found a radiator in one of the levels to cook ourselves on. Because you're trying to toast yourself for some reason as well. And that one hasn't really been explained yet. I mean, I don't judge it though. I'm just playing it. Um... But there's multiple areas to roast yourself. So like, the only thing we've seen so far that looked right was maybe trying to get into the car, but we're not really good at dropping the bricks off the building. 
and then the grill that's over there. I'm sure there's probably another way to do it. But the fact that this game was like, let's put multiple ways to win. Is also wild. Like, someone was sitting around and they went, you know what we should do? We should make a game where you're a piece of bread, but give it multiple ways to win. Because nobody would see that coming. And they're pretty much correct. Oh, yes, keep going. We're flying right now. No, yes. Oh, do this to me, game. Ah, oh, yeah. Woo, okay. We're actually doing, I'm really proud of myself right now. I'm really proud, really proud of myself. Not even kidding. It's it's a small thing to be proud of, but sometimes you got to take the small victories in life. Okay, hold on. So let's waddle over here. Come on, a little more. Okay. Come on. I know I can knock you over. I'm not gonna lie. I just really wanted to see Please. That. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Damn it. Okay, so we're our kung fu skills are really bad at this. So let's just stay the course of trying to get to the grill, I guess. Oh. All right. Now, if the controller wouldn't have died on us there, I feel like we might have been okay. Right? We were doing we were doing pretty good. down okay this is okay um we know we need to get up no don't you fall over but no no okay, hold on this is let's catch a red for a second here hold on Okay, so we need to get... Over there somehow, right? Well, we need... I don't think the grill's on yet, so what I'm thinking we have to do... Is... There's matches over there. I think we have to grab one of the match, Strike the box. Light the fire, and then put ourselves in? I think. I could be wrong. I could be wrong, but that's kind of what I'm seeing here. Oh. So with this, sometimes the face buttons will let you grab onto stuff so you can like grab stuff. I do agree with very carefully though. Yes. We're killing it this- No, not like this. Wait, hold on. Okay. No! No, no, no! Oh, okay. So we're not gonna be at full health, but that's fine, right? We're not here to get full health. We're just here to win. Come on. Um. Okay. Now then. So we cannot, okay. Why? Yes! Drop down. No! No, no, no! No! Okay, hold on, we get one more shot. <laughs> uh. This map has been so hard. Okay, here we go. So with the left trigger. Oh. 
Hey, we can just sit on the fire. Sort of. Wait, did my match fall through? Yes! Yes! I don't even care if we burn ourselves. Woo! We're done. Or we're about to be done. Yes! That was not the hardest level we've played, but it kind of was. We'll take a C. C stands for you did it. And then at the end, you get rated on how edible you were, which is weird. What your toast quality is, which literally makes no sense. There is a time limit. Oh, we just bricked on the time limit because we dropped our first match because we suck. That's bad. But I believe this is the last level for this. And then here, I, here's more of the story. After a night of distress shouting about a loaf of bread needing to be destroyed, the patient in question was able to overpower two security guards at 8.37 a.m. this morning while breakfast was being delivered. He made his way through the facility and left through a hatch in the services. Mr. Burton was last seen running across the, city, or the, the car park where he subsequently jumped the fence. The security guards called 999 at 8.55 a.m. At which point, Mr. Merton had already left the premises. His therapist and all authorities have since been notified and are currently coordinating a search of the local area. So, basically what they've done over the course is, is it sounds like our character didn't get a job or something. Maybe, well, I guess not our character. The main character? Something like that. Anyway, they didn't get a job. They kind of got a little crazy. And no one believes us that the bread is real. But we know the bread is clearly real. Okay, so let's. All right, I'm just gonna say, I love the detail on this game. So as we've played each level, the loaf gets a little smaller and a little smaller. Confirmed, the small things mattered. Okay. So. Uh, okay, let's look around quick here. Okay, so there's matches over there. So maybe there's something that we can light on fire. Uncle Jack's chicken dinner. One pound 49. That actually sounds pretty cheap for what you're getting there like. No real complaints there. That could be the answer, I don't know. Uh Okay, so Yeah, oh no, I threw real bad. No wait. No, come on, get up. Okay, so somehow the sign isn't considered disgusting. Um No 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 I'm bad at this game! this okay hold on get your breath here <sighs> okay so let's try to stand ourselves up here hmm okay so I'm thinking I see what we need to do because the there's lighter fluid or lighters right above the wood here I'm feeling like we gotta scorch the place. Maybe you're onto something here. Um, okay, let's. Wow, you're really the con okay. The controls right here are super janky on the. Uh... How are you not considered touching? You're literally touching it. There we go. Yeah. Huh? Okay. No. No. Wait. Okay. They didn't. They didn't hurt us. There we go. Okay. Now then, let's take this here. 
Come on. No, no, no. Fine. You don't want to go the way? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Okay, we're still in it. This, this has been the hardest level, only because there's all this stuff to climb? No, I guess the garage was kind of lame. The garage had a lot going on as well. Oh. Yeah. No! I'll learn, I'll learn. I'll learn, I'll learn. Um. Okay, so let's go... One... Okay, that's what we wanted to do. This is fine. No, no, no. Yeah. <gasps> this is ridiculous. Um. So we really can't move the wood, which I suppose is. Wait. Maybe we can. Um. Is there a way for us to move ourselves enough to grab onto something for momentum? Okay, a little bit. Here we go. Okay, let's roll this back this way. Okay, the controls here are rough. Come on, little piece of bread. Move, baby. Okay, so let go here. Why does everything here have to be shaped? Come on, please. Wait. An electrical box, you said? Uh-oh. Okay, hold on. It's like LA for bread. Don't question it, just accept it. Yes. No! Um... Okay. Yeah, we're going up. This is this is a good start. No, wait. All right, this game, like the story, it better end on something really, really good. Because I'm so invested in the story now. I want to know how how this bread is alive. Oh, okay. Good stuff. Don't you dare fall out. Yes. Something's burnt. Sounds like something blew up. I haven't been this invested in a story in forever. So let's try to get to a safe spot here first. No, no, no. Yes. Hmm. Like, that's clearly a thing, right? Here's the lighters. Can I grab a piece of paper, maybe? Come on, please. Come on. I know you can spark them. Oh, come on. No, game. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Shit, I think we're dead. No! Not like this. <laughs> okay. So there was clearly something going on there, right? Yeah, what if we go this way? prefer the sound of the electricity that's fair okay what do we got here okay and then get us up get us okay now I'm gonna try to eat okay now hold on here we're not touching the ground and we're not touching anything dirty okay uh no not like this okay uh, okay. 
Do I want to release these for now? No. Okay. Come on. Stop being wiggly and jiggly. You're not jello, you're bread. Damn it. No, 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 no. See, we tried to get a paper over there, and like, I don't know if maybe we, we just weren't touching right enough for the game or not, because like, we felt good about it, and then it just kind of like, gently disregarded our feelings and threw us off. Ah, uh, there we go. Hey, uh... Okay, that's fine. Right? That's not that much damage there. That's good stuff. That's good stuff. Okay. No! Is. So, new plan. Instead of going the way we went last time, what we're gonna do here is just try to cheekily go around this way, right? So, really? None of our bo- Nah, come on. That can't be like that. I don't believe that. Okay. Uh, okay. Now wait, hold on. Get the camera fixed here. <gasps> okay, so go back. Grab this way, and then grab this way. Sometimes you gotta fight with the controls a little bit. Nothing too bad, but the camera here is not helping. No! Why didn't you grab? I mean, we're not... We're doing okay. We're just not going... Exactly how we wanted to, you feel? No! Come on! You say you're touching the bag, but you won't climb up. You're hurting me, game. Right, because we're not trying to set records. We're just trying to beat the game. That was the challenge presented. You can walk on the floor a little bit. You're you're dirty anyway, right? Like we've we've already sort of yeah, we're dead. <laughs> okay, so one level has probably finally presented itself as a pain in the ass, and that's fine. You're allowed to get one. You're a physics-based jokey game, right? You're allowed to be a little upset with me. That's fine. Okay, so it seems like there's just certain points in this level where you can't hang on to stuff. Like right here, right? The right bumper is clearly touching the... So, this game has what's called shitty invisible boundaries. Well, we don't want you here, so instead of us just telling you no, your controllers just will not work. Okay. Come on. Like I said, I think this is the last level. So, like, if we can actually beat this, this would be the first game of our Streamsmith thing that we were actually able to tackle in one stream. And then this level rears his ugly head, and it's like, no, you're not. You're going to sit here for an hour with this cockball torture, and you're just going to accept it. There's nothing you can do about it. It's pure punishment, and you're gonna you're gonna smile while you do it. The game's not wrong, but this this area is 
No, we're not really touching the ground anymore, game. You can't tell me I have cooties. That doesn't work that way. Okay. Okay. I don't think we're going to be able to whip ourselves. Well, you know what? Nope. I was about to say, the game doesn't really make sense anyway. Yeah, we're dead. Life is pain. This is fine. This is fine, right? We're not. Um, no. Game. Oh, come on. Okay, this is fine, right? We're still, we're still chilling. We're vibing, we're vibing. But to create a masterpiece out of something so iconic is bread. Like, how do you make bread better? You make a game out of it. That was clearly... Okay, why aren't you touching that? Like, we're on this, right? We are 100% touching it, but it will not grab it. No! No, what the fuck are you doing? You gotta be kidding me right now. You weren't supposed to moonwalk away from your wall. You did me dirty there, Annie Freeze. You did me dirty. <clears throat> oh yeah. Sometimes it's not as clean as other times, but we're not we're not trying to do the best run. We're just trying to do a run, you know what I mean? Okay, so let's get into position here. Okay. Wait, why are you trying to go this way, game? This is fine, right? Let's try to get ourselves... here again okay okay uh, fall down go boom yes Uh, please, game. Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that game? Fine. No, not again. Okay. Whew. No, 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 no. Not like this. Come on, get back up. Oh, there just seems to be um, some really janky grab detection, I guess, here. I mean, I guess you could call it hit detection, too, but like it feels really janky right now. Like this area here does not feel like it was fully thought out in terms of like grabbing and touching stuff now that's okay
but the physics on some of this stuff if this is full right like if these if these antifreeze things are full either we have the strongest slice of bread humanly a manager man or or yes okay get out the way move move come on don't you know who i am i'm bread get out of here no okay oh yes Okay. I just, I just wanna, I just want to toast my bread. Okay? It shouldn't be this hard. You know what I mean? Um. No! No, 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 no. We are so close to like, I swear, it's got it's got to be something with these matches. Well, it, one of the ways has to be with these. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Now wait. Oh, no, not like this. <laughs> this is the only level that's been this rough. Like, I gotta say, it's... Outside of this, it's been pretty surprising how great the maps have been. This one, though, it feels like pain and suffering just for the, the purpose of pain and suffering. And while we all know that's what I'm into, like... This is a lot of pain and suffering. Like this is one of those moments where it's like, how much is too much? Now, come on game. Just let me, let me flop my bread ass up there. No, come on. Like right now the controls, right? Are not making any sense. Like I, I'm pushing in directions to try to get up there. It normally would not work like that. Ah! This map is pulling my love for this game way down right now. Like, I cannot handle this. How bad this, this map just feels so bad. It's so bad. Why game? You were a piece of bread out of 10. And now you're like a half piece of non-buttered toast out of four. Okay, here we go. Come on. That's right. When all else fails, just push yourself through. Okay. saying I'm almost out of ideas now <laughs> I felt pretty good with that and the box appears to be too heavy for us to move this game
So there's no proof that this is what we need to do. But you cannot tell me that somehow starting the electrical will have no effect. All right, so I appear to be stuck. Oh, wait, as no, 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 come on game. Yeah. Um, no, okay. We're not, we're not out of it yet. Though we are quickly running out of mistakes to make. Um, so let's... Oh, come on. Okay. No. Why are you fucking closing? Why are you closing? You have no right to close. You have no perception of open. Okay, hold on. Does this thing legit just close on its own? Okay, hold on. You are a piece of shit. Wait. Maybe you're not. Hold on. Maybe I take back everything I've ever said bad about you. But probably not. Today, big boy. There we go. Dude, my head's about to blow up. Like, oh, come on. Do not. Yes. 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 That's only half the battle. <laughs> Come on, my little piggy friend. Get up there. Come on, get up. I know you can. You're the worst fucking piece of bread in the world, but I know you have it in you to stop sucking. Even if it's just for like two seconds. Fine, you don't know fucking go to sleep. I don't care. I'll figure this out. <laughs> oh my god. This is so wild. The fact that someone was like, you know it would make a great game. Up. Oh. Okay. Why can we not grab the top of the box? Like it's flat in there. Why? Fine, you know what? We'll try to go this way. kind of feel for the bread though like we've been there like three in the morning you know what I mean okay Have a lighter. Hold on. So it's not about sparking the newspaper. 
What are you doing? Oh wait, grab that bag. No, not the box. I just need the one lighter. Thank you. Like, I'm honestly not sure what to do here. Like... What an odd game to be stumped by. Come grab it. Come on, your hand is right there. have dropped our match or our lighter and I don't really think there's going to be a clean way for us to get this I think this run just ended no 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 wait Okay, hold on. Okay. So somehow glass is safe touch? No, no, no! No! Yes? Please, please! Like, I see... Like, I almost want to cheat and grab the jelly. Or wherever the hell the... Can't believe it's not butter is or whatever. I think what that does too is I think that maybe regen some of your stuff back, but like, fuck. I don't want to beat the level that way. Like, I want to do it in the purest manner possible, but I just, I'm looking at the way that this is functioning right now, and it's just like, I don't know if I fucking trust this game. Because, like, it's just, nothing is connecting here. Nothing is clicking right, and none of the buttons are working properly, the grabs and the stuff. It just, it feels a little off in this map. 
Now, I believe this game is still in early access, so I suppose they could fix it. But holy shit, this is going to kill me. I like how you legit jelly yourself. <laughs> so stupid. Okay. So I'm looking at this here and I'm going, what are my actual outs? Now. Maybe it has, it does have something to do with like these papers. I'm not exactly sure how, right? But maybe this would help us make like a better bridge. You feel? That did not work as intended. Okay, hold on. So let's... This is going to be the death of me. Like, this game is literally going to kill. Just this level. It's going to give me a brain aneurysm. Or at least an aneurysm of what's left in there. Like, the fact that there's so many things that we cannot grab onto in this area. I don't understand. The game is breaking all of its rules right now. Like right there, uh, we can only touch in certain areas. Like, how is that? Don't get me wrong, right? When you touch, you got to touch and like, that's fair. But like, it just doesn't feel right in this map. It feels very sloppy. <gasps> okay. Uh... Oh, fuck you, game. Get me heated, game. Fuck this. Come here, infinite life jelly. Fuck you. You win, game. Because you're being a piece of shit right now. And I'm done with it. Not dealing with your shit anymore. I quit. I quit, I quit, I quit. Huh? Thought you wouldn't eat me. Yeah, look at this shit. Huh? You're about to eat something that was all over the ground. How dumb do you look? Okay. I get up here and pop this. Ah. Okay. Now then. It's going to be the most satisfying thing I've ever done if this is actually what we had to do. And if not... This game can suck my ass. Come on, game. Don't do me like this. All right, I'm too banged up right now. For it. it ain't gotta be this mean to me. <gasps> I feel like maybe if we use the um, the electrical, right? Like that'll, that's the key here. No, 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 no. Well, okay. We can't die anyway. So at this point now, it's a race against my frustration. And this game's kind of winning a little bit, well not a lie. Like, we took the infinite life jelly just because I got sick of it. We had to break down finally. That's awful. Like that's downright degrading. Now just slide off so I can grab you on the way out. Thank you. No. Don't want you wait, you fucking close. Come on. Get up. Get up, please. Oh, fuck you. 
game. I hope whoever made you doesn't sleep well tonight. I hope they're up all night. Like some dude with a big ass beard is fucking he mad. He's so mad at me. I should fix that last level just for him. What? Hold on. That's what I'm gonna try to do. Yeah, let's get you out of the way. Very good. Now then. Deep down, I kinda hope this isn't it. Just so my frustration can continue to grow. have the power to move it oh yeah we do come on okay now then well I suppose that's just rolling physics though like that's What if this was just a trap? Because I don't think we can actually move this that way. At all. And I don't think we can grab this either to move it? No. Uh... So we can, but nothing happens. But let's grab one of the uh, matches or the the lighter, right? Maybe that's the trick. I got so many words I want to say to you, game. None of them right now or night. I mean, the good thing is here is we have infinite grip, so like we should be able to just truck our ass along once we get one. Okay. No, don't you tell me click. I'm not even uh, touching you. I'm not even touching you. Okay. Now, give me one. Give me one. I mean, I will take the whole box, but can't I just have one? Thank you. And away we go. Was that really how we had to cook ourselves there? We had to blow up the gas station? Uh, what? Uh, I'm toast. <laughs> needs, I still love that needs improvement. There's one more level? No, no, no. To whom it may concern. It was the bread. It's always been the bread. It needs to become toast and will stop at nothing. My house was the start, but it won't end there. I was forced to escape the therapy barn. I should have destroyed the bread when I had the chance. Now there's been an explosion across town, and I know it's the bread. I'm going to find that cursed loaf and end this once and for all. You're kidding me! Hey, wait. Hey, hold on. What? Okay, wait, hold on. Okay, so 
so we need to probably get out of the vehicle first and foremost or something okay, so it won't let us really climb anymore okay so this we need to figure out then what we need to do like how to turn ourselves to get out of here I'm not really sure. Can we grab the axe? Yeah, we cannot grab the axe. I love how there's like an axe, a body bag. Oh! They get us out. Oh, yes! Okay, hang on. No, no, no. Oh? Okay, so let's fall down here for a moment. I'm not 100% sure what we're shooting for here. Wait. What the hell? Hey! Oh, we probably could have slipped in the glass earlier! This is so stupid. Don't get me wrong. I love it, but it's dumb. Okay. So let's get up this. Come on. Get up this way. Ah, okay. So let's let's try to get up. Oops. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. While hanging here. Oh, yes. Okay. All right. Do we have bullets on us? I think we're holding bullets. No, oh, I hit the wrong one. That might be okay. I just want to know why he would be so irresponsible as to put the bed in the back and then not lock the trunk. License play two is bread. Bob, poor Bob. The fact that this actually has a story had a story. Like, what the fuck was that? I love that. We got God. Damn. Tacos maybe missed the end. I mean, I don't feel too bad because, like, unintentionally cheated on one level.
we definitely intentionally cheated on the other level. Thank you for becoming toast. No, thank you. Winky face. I also like too, that like from the main menu, you can also go to like a Team Fortress 2 level and you can go to some other secret levels and stuff too. There's a goat sim level. Like the game is still getting updated, which is wild. Plus all the game modes, bagel race. I don't know what that is. Just, we did the story mode cheese hunt. Like if they weren't at minimum, then boo. That was a fucking game. I can't believe, like the best thing legit was that it had a story. It's a meme game that tried. And seeing that there's all, all these other game modes to futz with too. <laughs> that was so dumb. The good thing is, the good thing is with this game, is that it's probably going to be the only game we beat in our allotted stream time for the streams miss streams. In one sitting, which I like. I mean, you figure we got what? That was three hours out of it, right? That's pretty good. I'm surprised that that had as much uh, stuff to it as it did, right? We got, we got another achievement too. Only not even 4% of players on Steam have completed every story level. How could you not? Can I read the rest of the achievements or are they all just like hidden? Get an A++, yeah, that's not gonna happen. I love the name of the achievement. Cool story, though. A wedge between us, get some age and cheese hunts. Complete all the rampage levels, defeat all the bagel race, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Finish the story level 100% edibility without using magic marmalade. Psh. Finish a story level with both sides covered in jam. The name of the achievement, you jelly. <laughs> the walking bread. Finish a story level. With less than 1% edibility, how do you get below 1 in this game and not die? Is that even ach achievable? Stay airborne for 5 seconds, the bread baron. Climb atop the garbage truck? I didn't even see a garbage truck. What fucking garbage truck are you talking about? <laughs> Donny Hawk. Stand upright on the skateboard and ride it for 1 meter as the wholemeal bread. All buttered up. Finish the story level covered in butter. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. I like that. We got time. Because poop is calling. <laughs> I go play Mario Party with the fam. Stream after. See you, buddy. Have a good day. Enjoy the Mario Party. Hopefully you do. I'm assuming you will. And that was amazing. Like I said, the fact that it actually had a little bit of story, it showed it cared. Like, it is a meme game, but like, for, I, what, like the two or three bucks on sale, to get three hour to, hours out of it, a buck an hour, I have no complaints. Like, that was ridiculous. How can you only give it a mixed review? I want to know what they didn't like about it. Give me a negative review. Straight mustard face? What the hell does that even mean? I did not like it. Not even my son liked it. It's really annoying. It wasn't annoying. You just gotta work with the physics. Wow, someone has 165 hours. I don't remember buying or playing this, but I have 165 hours on it. Winky face? Yeah, sure you don't. It's a psychological horror game. I don't know about that. There's... There's no dang nabbed physics. Yes, there is. It's just they, they did take us the first like half an hour or so to really grasp the movement and stuff.
It'll make you pull your hair out, and that's exactly why it's so good. I am bread. So what? Thumbs up. Now, that was, that was good stuff. I'm very glad that that was recommended to us. Just another solid game to throw into the pile of Streamsmith games. We have, what, one more game this week yet, which is, I think, Escape the Tarkov with one of my kids. And that'll round out this week for the Streamsmith streams. Very good stuff. I'm super glad that we played that. I'm glad that uh, Schneider was the one who recommended that to us. That was hilarious. And it had a story. Like, how do you not care about the characters? Right? How do you not care? That was lovely. I don't know if that was my favorite game this week, but I definitely had fun with it. I will give the game that. I had a lot of fun with it. That was worth, that was worth our three, four hours of time. And we got some new inventory items, allegedly. I'm assuming they're going to be the weird Steam cards that you can do stuff with. That is exactly what. Still don't understand the point of them 100%, but more power to people who do. Oh, man. Well, we hit our four hours for the day. Time for me to go get food and me. Time for me to go relax myself a little bit. So I want to thank everyone for coming out today. Hopefully, you enjoyed I Am Bread. I know I did. What's tomorrow? Friday. So we won't be streaming tomorrow. But we'll be back with another Streamsmith on Saturday. Playing Escape from Tarkov with Cheeky Breaky Cheese. So I hope everyone has a great rest of their morning, afternoon, or evening. Hopefully you get to do cool stuff between today and tomorrow. With people you like and all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, we will see you when we see you. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. That's all you can ask for if someone rolls through. Hopefully they go, hey, this person ain't that terrible. We'll take it. We'll take that all day. We will never complain about that. But uh, yeah, thank you for coming out. Hopefully you enjoyed yourself. And we will be back on Saturday with something a little more serious than it was today. But Streamsmiths ain't about me. It's about giving back to our longtime followers what they wanted. So have a great day. And we will see you when we see you, everybody. Peace.